Uh, v2I Kemi. Thanks for two years. T2, legend. We're giving Let pig. It's the four months. Love your pest. Let the grinds begin. Sounds like I'm from Gladio. Let the games begin. All right. We have 49 tasks remaining. We actually got a lot done yesterday. We got a lot done. Uh, yesterday, we, of the stuff we still have to do, we got an extra gun for test drive, which is actually pretty pog. We got six kills for Punisher Part 5. We only need three more. Now um, you can drink beer legally in Germany. Yes. We've been killing Usex on, on here. We don't even need this task. Easy job. We got two of that done. Uh, we got one of our therapist tasks done. We, we still have crisis to go. Uh, we do have this task to do. However, we are going to kill Senator. Uh, vitamins, we got one of the... Uh, we, well, we got the item out of Shoreline, so now we just need to get in Emicon. Uh, long road, we got two kills for. Don't need house arrest or no swiping. I have a million channel points. What can I do with them? I'll collect them. Get to, get to the four million. Hey, Gamba. Uh, I was putting stuff in a mentor, but I realized I don't even need to. Um, so I could just go to max... Uh, max level stash space. Um, I also do have nine Bitcoin, which is now worth nine million, eight point one million. So arguably, I could go for doing that. Uh, Lendlease, we start. We finished Lendlease part one. We handed in the coffin. We still need two vertexes, which is lighthouse. Uh, sniper stuff. I want to start collecting snipers. We still haven't got the stems. We got four kills towards overpopulation and one towards insomnia. Don't need to do those. Gunsmith. Let's just say Nikita has a list and he's checking it twice. He's sent it off to his boys and hopefully he's nice. How's that for a rhyme? So I, I sent off a list uh, that Dead Pine hooked me up with uh, about all the really sticking points for gun gunsmith tasks for hardcore. And I asked if he could add some barter trades to the game. He might add some. He might add them, add them all. He's done it in the past for me. But it does make it so hardcore is actually feasible, you know? Because otherwise, like, we could spend 10 hours, hours or maybe more, 50 hours just looking for gunsmith parts, which would just be a bit lame. How are you doing, mate? Shooter born. We got two kills yesterday on shoreline, I think. We definitely got one, if not two. Watching is not needed or the door. The door. Uh, we've been find st finding stuff hey, for text off, which we don't need. We finished Ragman completely. Uh, Living High is not a crime is now finished, so Ragman is completed now for hardcore. Uh, and then for Jaeger. Jaeger. We still need to get sniper kills. Uh, I was hoping to run into Glucker. We didn't. Today's choices are we start farming Sturman on woods and in hope to find more Baltis and killing Sniper Scavs. Um, my theory is we should try and get Sturman, Killer, and Rashala done. If we get those three done, then we get the goons unlocked. It can be quite painful trying to do these tasks, though. But if we can get those three done, we get the goons unlocked, and then uh, that will make life a lot better. Top of the morning. Show microwave. Faster chat faster. So it's 36 months subscribed. Now? Nice. Glad to be here. Pestily salute. Thank you, thank you. <clears throat> oh, and the last but not least thing that we did, which was awesome, was we got... Um... Uh, what did we get? We got we got scav case up uh, unlocking. So this will be done in sixty five hours, and then that means we get a free gamba every not free, but we get a gamba. So happy with that. So it was a pretty huge day, in other words. We got some massive kills on Lighthouse. Like we're talking sweaty, sweaty players on Lighthouse. All right. So I think we start on the Rishala Killer Sturman farm. I think we'll start with Sturman. Because we can farm some Balties. And then if we get a good collection of Balties, we can then go... Um, do Tarkov Shooter. Because Tarkov Shooter is going to be a bit of a, a pain. So let's start with that. We'll start with trying to kill Sturman. We did a heap of lighthouse stuff. 
Honestly, the only thing on Lighthouse I would like to get done is this one. This is probably the higher priority because it leads to peacekeeping mission. And then that means we don't have to hold on to blue armors. So I'm starting to collect all the blue stuff. Um, and it would be nice to get peacekeeping mission done. So the other option is we farm Lindley's. I'll, I'll, I'll put it to you. Farm Sturman or, or, or Vertex's chat. One for Sturman, two for, two for Vertex's. Yeah, it's definitely more Sturmans. All right, let's just get Sturman done. We can grab some Baltis. And then we'll go from there. Uh, I think we have a ZB key, don't we? Love it here. Thanks for being great. Maybe we handed it in. We must have. Vertex is a boring grind. Mm. Are you going to do sniper, a psycho sniper? I'm going to shoot him in the head. Yeah, this will do. Uh, woods. Let's go. Vertex means killing raiders can be fun. No, lighthouse. You don't need to. I don't. I don't farm that section. I just farm the um, the chalets and the Marin and the hillside. We could probably get it in about five raids if we rush the spawns. I reckon five raids would have it done. The fourth pound, thanks to the 32 months. Pretty 420, thanks to the two months. Divine Vigilante, thanks to the three months. Uh, sorry, three years. You fool, Pestid, it's three years, not three months. Tea Leaf, thanks to the seven months. Mad. Mardigan, thanks to the 19 months. President Richard Nixon, thanks to 200 bits. Stingray 87, thanks to 16 months. No word of a lie. The reason why our intro went for so long is was I was watching... I was watching Hera play Age of Vampires against um, the Tato. Did he win? Anyone know? <sighs> did you watch any Hidden Cup? I did. I did. Spanky Soft Palm. Thanks for the four months. Number Jester with the 33 months. Well, hello there. Good morning, sir. The Tay Tay, thanks for the prompt. JB, thanks for 30 months. Why? Hello there. Does my OG Pestid intro song get used anymore? Not really, no. Thanks for the YouTube content. My pleasure, dude. Kraken07, thanks for 27 months. What do you prefer on your burger? Oh, dude, I'm a bit of a burger connoisseur. Connoisseur? Um, I, I like pressed. lots of varieties of burgers. Lots of variety of burgers. It's Okay, so you know how like people have their poison? Mine used to be ice cream, but now I think it's burgers. So like if I do a big event, say the subathons or I don't know, like Kappa speed runs and stuff, I generally after it to celebrate the finish, I go and get a burger and I go to like the best burger places in Adelaide or like, you know, I make, I make like a big deal of it. Yeah. Killing Sturman gets you a VPX. We don't need any VPXs. Have good red dad. Uh, Jeffy, how you going, mate? Uh, how you doing today? Trying to catch up with the hardcore series. Yeah, the, so the YouTube's about a week behind now. I deliberately didn't play hardcore for like close to a month just so the YouTube would catch up. And I uh, could get some other stuff done. Airstrike Gaming, dude, thanks for seven months. All right, big raid, big raid. We need to collect snipers. We actually need two vertexes too. While we take advantage of the lag trip. All right, so the lag was there, so it's most likely not here. But it does mean we can check for a... What extract do we have? All right. 
So we check for Athletics. And then we'll head out. Fire Sniper Scout. Give us a Lettex on the first raid of the day. Nothing. Not missing it. You guys are going to yell at me for missing it? I don't think there's any items in the technical supply crate that we actually need. Is it? Oh, nuts and bolts can be handy. Bossy rag raid already. Oh, we just need to go sniper scope now. Have you tried Barry's Burgers down at Semaphore? Is that the one right near the water? Yes, I have, sir. My favourite burger shop in Adelaide right now is uh, is it called Empire Burger or Diamond Burger on Port Rush Road? Diamond burger. Don't you think hardcore does well because everyone's grinding slow and you want to see and want to see you be at their level? Uh, you mean like well as a viewership kind of thing? I think hardcore is a very good viewing experience for the fact that. It makes everything have value. Whereas, and I was explaining this to, was it Wellen? Who was I talking to? So the biggest issue with Tarkov, when it comes to looting and that, is you don't loot. And this is what makes the player, the difference between good players and newer players. You don't loot based off what you need. You loot based off what's the highest value. For example, you could loot an armor that's 12 squares, but it might be worth like 70k. And you're like, oh, I need that armor. That's a cool armor. That's a great armor. And you'll grab that. It's worth 70k. But the smarter thing to do is to loot 12 squares worth of loot that is worth like of higher value per square. So it might be worth, I don't know, 15k a square. So that 12 squares now, you know, like 180k. So then you spend that, you sell that stuff for 180,000 rubles and then use those 180,000 rubles to buy that 70,000 armor and then buy other stuff. And that's the difference with... Oh, no way that... No, nah, no. Nah. There's no way that Sherman. It was lag. That's a guy faking it. Chat. But it's, a, it's an SVD. We need SVDs. So you yeah, That's an SKS, so I don't need... That's not a snipe scab I need. Do you reckon that was a faker? That was a lot of shots. An SVD would be nice though. That sniper scan is right on the edge of the rock. I think I see someone. So yeah, um, and then the difference with, with hardcore is, right, everything in hardcore has value. 
Like everything. You can pick up some bolts. Oh, I can need that to use the to do the mag case trade. Or I need that for my hideout upgrade. Just an SKS up there. So we need it. We need bolties. So yeah, that's uh, that's. I think that's what makes hardcore way more immersive and much more in viewing, better viewing experience than just normal Tarkov. Is the fact that. You know, like, everything can have some meaning. Whereas, main account, it's just like, run around, shoot some stuff, grab some loot, get out. It's not really, it's exciting. Um, and probably the last but not least is, hardcore makes the, um, hardcore makes the, lows more painful and the highs more high whereas like when you guys see me play Tarkov normally on my main account it's like oh I died oh well just gear up go again GG next when I die on this and I've got like I'm trying to do test drive oh or even just like doing Punisher 5 yesterday and I didn't have uh and I had the um the pack is on in that you know, like dying on Punisher 5, losing a Packer and a 6B helmet, pisses you off. Setup pisses me off. I actually didn't go too bad with setup on hardcore this fight, which is good. Being stuck on Punisher 6 with 14 out of 15 was rough. Dude, I think I only have one SVD. I'm not sure what's going to happen with that. All right, we go again. How about we rotate? We do one Sturman, and then we go to to Linehouse. Marin Hillside. This is reserve, but. Would be sick if BSG would make some kind of hardcore mode. They're actually thinking about doing it. Like, ooh, morning might slap here. I don't know. Uh, Spaos, th ninety-three. Thanks for seven months. That's okay, you are much better at this game than me, and I'm terrible my am I terrible shitty. Yeah, but 15 kills is 15 kills, bro. Like, you know what I'm thinking about doing for the SVD kills dead point, and I know it's kind of lame, is just getting somewhere on streets with high traffic flow and just camping it. Like, relax room. Try try and get over somewhere near relax room or check 15 or even the, the down chopper crash site something like that and just camping it because yeah
I don't play hardcore, but I found it funny to run the longest barrel shotgun with an ACOG optic, trying to get those long range headshots at the river. Now that would work. The problem is the slugs. The best slug in the game is really difficult to get, the AP20s. Now they fixed it. The window exploit. 44 Big months. Mac, thanks for 44 Time months. really does fly. It feels like the Strays incident was just yesterday. The Stairs incident? Yeah. Just inspired me to do Zero to Heroes on Reserve, and I quite enjoy it, thanks. Nice, no man. What task are we working on? I'm rotating between killing Sturman and um, farming the Vertexes on Lighthouse. I've got a lot of tasks for Lighthouse. The, one, the major task I want to get done is Len Lenly, so it goes to Peacekeeping Mission. The only thing... With that, is streets can be hard to extract late raid with all the players here sometimes, but I also don't know the map super well. The, the thing, this is the, the thing that makes streets really good for it, Dead Pine, is escape and evasion is super easy on streets because you can just duck into buildings and run through doorways and, and close doors and all that, and people get really confused on where you went. It's like, damn, he's gone, like from Metal Gear Solid. That works really well on streets, whereas on other maps, they can chase you down easily. And the other thing is, if you don't move much on streets, it's pretty simple that people will come past you and they won't know you're there. Like if I got to spawn near Relax, I could literally just camp the door. Bam, Relax key. Worst case scenario, I get some player scavs. Going on tour for six months on Sunday. Already can't wait to binge all your content when I'm back. Dude, stay safe, all right? Yeah. Honestly, like, my biggest complaint about Last Wipe's hardcore dead pine was I played too much streets. So it's probably a good thing that you rotate it. Because uh, I was just going streets every raid because it was the easiest way to get heaps of loot and good gear. Nexus Let's 30, go thanks for the hardcore. You're not hardcore. Unless you live hardcore. And the legend of the rent was way hardcore. Uh, 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 uh. How many hours do I have? Too many. Managed to get all my punishes six kills on customs. Which, in retrospect, was a bad idea, but we got there in the end. Yeah, I would normally say Customs would be the best map to do it, but I would be hesitant to go there. Not because of getting kills. I don't think getting kills is a problem. It's surviving. Hi, Pest. My 10-week-old son loves watching you. Oh, say hello for me. Hello, son. That's your really good spawn for the Vertexes. If we get one in this shallow, we just turn around and go back. And still here. Much fun and much entertainment. Thanks, Reapers. Thanks for 22 months. Yeah, that's that's the biggest issue about customs, is the fact that it's not the actual... Um, it's not the actual killing of players. It's the actual getting to the extract. 
Moist. Was that some that's kind of jumped or went prone? Like my head intact. Hopefully they all counted. Is that not? Cool, they counted. We should check their backpacks. They might have one splint. Pogies. Dan! <sighs> Don't need propane. Fifty-eight kilo. What the fuck are we gonna do about this? Like, actually, how the fuck are we going to get out with this? It's only three kilo, but... Adds up, you know. Only cash. It's only 200 grams though. Mm. 
moist. Mother flipping seven to zero. Big old pest loving months. Dump bag. Doesn't make a huge difference, but it does make a difference. Eight months, cake. Lighthouse has been such a good map for us to kill geared players. Could have dropped the side planes. They're only two gear though. What about it's a little better? Like, it's not like I have, like, level zero strength. I actually have a little bit of level, so... I think I'm, like, level 18 strength. Yeah, eight, no, 14 strength. The problem with this is really I'm extracting just to get rid of a, a drop off a helmet contacts and armor. That's all right. This will actually be a much better gun on woods to kill Sturman. Tony Pilar, thanks for the two months. Oshi Zora, 404, thanks for the prime. Max Fletcher, thanks for the eight months. All right. So there's no vertexes there, but we got a little bit of loot out. We got a Dan. These are some high level dog tags. Just give me one sec.
Hello. Uh, sneaky, thanks for 12 months. Oh, and we did get three more scav kills at the chalet. Correct. All progression. Hi, Pest. Where's the best place I can ask you a question besides here? Um, Discord, but I'm not the best at replying on Discord. Like, I have, like, 50-something message requests. Like Pyro sends me messages and I send him one word responses. That's how good I am. Ooh, this had BP in it. And then he gets sad. I don't need this ADAR, but I do want the ammo out of it. Uh, we might keep the night vision today. We need to we need to get to the point where we can clean up some space because how I see it currently going is we are probably Boarding a little bit too much weapon parts, and we need to fix that. Does the new M1A have a hybrid suppressor? It does. Where did we dump that? Here. It's literally ready to go for test drive. So I'll probably try and get a few of these together. I'm, I'm trying to figure out what map to do it on. Like, we could probably camp outskirts on woods, or even just anywhere on woods, like car extract. Because nearly everyone goes to the car extract, right? Um, and just be patient. I, this task here, test drive, is the one that probably scares me the most because to remake the M1A, it's really fucking difficult. Like, I need to get an M1A. I need to get a hybrid suppressor. I have to have this specific site. Like, that's a lot of work. All right, let's try and get Sturman. We're going we're gonna to go between woods and... Um, I'm just that little bit over. Uh, what was I going to do? There was something I thought I was going to do. Oh, like a Vaseline or a... Augmentant's better than nothing. Splint. This might still be good. Pestily salute, pestily salute, pestily salute.
Uh, Juice Jenna, thanks for the 51 month. 51 month. Sorry, I'm doing something in the background at the moment. Hey, Pesto, uh, been enjoying the before death vid. Pretty entertaining to see you guys go climb mountains. I'm glad you're enjoying it, man. I believe Pest will survive, but the juice is too good on the other side. Who's voting against me? Is there a prediction? Seventy five twenty five. That's fair. I'd take that bet. My survival rate's like sixty seven percent or some shit, so I didn't bet, but I believe you'll survive. I will survive. Hey, hey. Oh. I cooked dinner the other night. For the first time in God knows how long. Cooked a nice beef stroganoff. Kind of maybe miss cooking, you know? I feel like cooking more. I actually haven't made desserts in so long. Like, I'm talking... 2018 would have been the last time I made some dessert, like ice cream or cookies or what else did I use to make? Slices, cakes, everything. I used to love doing it. Like we did the Hello Fresh stuff during the subathon in like 2021. <sighs> what is a slice? What what do you guys call like what do you guys call slices in America or Europe? Like if you got a, a hedgehog caramel slice, a lemon slice, maybe brownie. What well, you might like call, you guys might call it a brownie. Tray bake. Bonte, thanks so much for the five months. Are doing well less than three. I am, and hope hope everything's going well with you, mate. I, I, I've been meaning to message you so much. We had a we've had a crazy few weeks, but we shall chat soon. Like uh, caramel slice. Like this is a slice. Where we went like. Lemon slice. What do you call this? Or brownie? Bars. Hey, pest. Hey, mate. I left that lead where you asked me to less than three. Okay, cool. I'll go get it now. On my way. Love you, man. Sugary square thing. Lemon bar brownie of chocolate. So if it's got caramel with the, with chocolate, so it's like biscuit, caramel, and then chocolate. Is that a brownie? And do you say caramel or caramel? Okay, where the frick is this guy? Didn't get dressed up for nothing. I've been breaking my legs getting down this recently. We need these if we wanted to do the um There he is. Oh. 
It's an SKS. Go kill the sniper scab on woods. You'll get snipers. You're lying to me, chat. Let's go check. Uh, while we're here, we might as well go check for uh, lead X's because um, we need two lead X's for crosses. most certainly looted, but yeah, there's that small chance that someone hasn't looted it. And plus, I, I really wouldn't mind getting some more uh, painkillers. Hello, do you have any advice for beginner type of plays? Escalation Mark Raid and Escalation Mark New. I'm updating my new player playlist. It's got all the newest guides on each of the maps. And uh, the Raid series is like a walkthrough, talk through, play through of Tarkov, which I'm going to be starting a new one soon. Uh, Water Bear AF, thanks to the Prime. So in two weeks time, I'm going to go visit family away. Um, in a state for two, for two. Two weeks. I think I'm tripping. Can I hear someone? And I'm tr gonna try and set it up that I can film it while I'm there. We'll see how we go. Delta Squad 622, thanks for 10 months. I'll just keep working on new player guides. I really hope someone's not just sitting up there. Brooks 90, thanks for the 9 months. Little Drizzle, thanks for the 13 months. So this is... I'm not going to jinx it, hopefully, but this is the advantage of doing a transition time. I find that people really don't like picking them where they transition into night time. They're like, oh, I don't want to be in the raid. It's going to go night time. Who's Obadoth Coward? Check the convoy. Is, I know there's like a like one med spawn, but there's not that many, right? Like not enough to go out of my way to check. This area terrifies me. Gun. It's a pistol.
Yeah, twenty-five percent chance to kill. Used to be an M4 spawn on that right there. Seven and forty-two. Mind if I do? an M4 spawn. You know the one that I love to find is the one on top of the rock. The fully pimped out M4. Alright, we need to get out of here. Plus my bedtime. Driver's side. I don't know what's going on with me at the moment, but every time I fart, I feel like I'm gonna like I need to get a gas mask out and gas myself. I think I'm putrid. Yesterday was the same. What did I eat? Stroganov. I ate stroganov. there. I don't the shack's here. It's the rock behind the shack. White raid. I swear to God, when people know that the boss is near, it's like, I'm out. Give me a Ledex. Go on, do it. No balls. No balls, Nikita. No balls, Nikita. She's not even scavs here. It's so dark. Who turned off the lights? Do AI scavs have worse vision at night? Yes. Correct. Blinded by the light. Da -da 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 Guess I get rid of the grizzly. Shift. RK2. And that? I wonder if AV1 would make that uh, night vision, night raid viable on stream. M80. S and B. Oh, man, this, this area is goaded. Right, we'll get rid of that. Hell, we'll get rid of that. High pest. 
Hey mate, how you doing? We dropped the rubles actually. Maybe we can take this a little back. Cool, let's get out. One hoods, one lighthouse. What do you think of every map being night and day like factory? No, because then you wouldn't have the transitions. One thing Tarkov does really well is that, that beautiful sunset or sunrise that where it glows the sky. I think that looks really cool. I actually kind of wish factory had like something similar. So like, you know, in factory, it, like there's the windows going around the edges. If it was like becoming nighttime and it had all like the, the light piercing through the, like the windows, I think that'd be really cool. Best gun for killing killer pestily. Uh, the SVT or the AVT. It's cheap. You don't need uh, a rig to, rig to run it. You can run it with the ammo in your pockets. You could technically just go naked and just take the gun. Honeman, thanks so much for the raid. Hope an amazing stream, dude. Night or daytime for killing him the easiest. Oh, bro. Transition times are always the easiest. But I think probably daytime. One, because he's easier to see. But two, a lot of people go nighttime for chumming. And they're deliberately going in there to kill players. So if you go nighttime, you're running into players that are direct, uh, deliberately trying to kill. So 10 p.m. to 10 a.m., you've got people trying to get chumming done. Then there's also long line on top. So you've got to be like, it's a much of a muchness kind of thing. I, I would probably lean towards daytime being better just for the fact that you can at least see better. And there's nothing worse than when you're playing on nighttime and you, you get killed before you can even run in there. We need to do something about this stash. It's getting to the point where we're, we're running out of spades. What about an item case? How much is an item case? 14,000 euro. What's that cost? A couple of mil? Two point two mil. Yeah, I, I think we I think we do that. I don't actually want to do that like that. Oh, that would be so good if you could put all four of them in there. What can I put in there? What would fit well? Maybe all the stuff at the top. I could do something like this.
me think. It's not it's not perfect, but it's better. I actually don't know why I kept that. Med mag ammo. Med mag ammo. Alright. This one's meant to be gear. I'm actually tempted to buy one more. The weapon case is full. We're holding holding on to so many weapon parts because of gunsmith stuff, but we're we're kind of trapped. Wouldn't mind. Okay, so let's see what we need to get another holy deal, Nick. So I wouldn't mind getting another one. All right, one squash, four tacola, seven hot rods. Hold on, it can also go in it. Hot rods are a pretty simple craft. I work with low wave for Moses. We actually got, um, I think it's 20 songs coming very soon. All Tarkov inspired. I normally go into Lighthouse, right? This is so ridiculous. I go into Lighthouse with a, um, like a SKS and a PSO or a fucking AK and a PSO. And then I come out with, um, Full Chad gear. Then I go back in with the Chad gear and then I die. But yeah, if anyone's interested in using it, it's uh, DMCF free. As in you got, oh, it's not DMCF free. It's, it, you guys can use it without any risk of being DMCA'd over it. any of my music. Either on your live stream or YouTube. YouTube. Just request if you use it in YouTube videos to um, put a link in the description. That's it. Don't see EFT Shut next time. And take my money. All right. Sorry.
Curse any chance Hunt makes into the streams. Hunt showdown. Um, yeah, for sure. I actually enjoy playing Hunt Showdown. Right. I'm gonna make a dash for the chalet. Try and get in there before anyone else. that triple scab spawn again. This is really annoying. I don't need the gear. <laughs> I just want the vertexes. I don't want to know your name. I just want bang, bang, bang. I don't want to meet your mom. I just want bang, bang, bang. Surprised when he pushed down that I didn't clap him because he looked like he was super exposed. Oh, fuck me. Is this really all BP? How do I get the ammo to work? What's with this bug with the ammo?
Hello? At least we're getting really good ammo. Like, SKS is actually going to be really strong for us now. OP SKSs. We can keep this uh, momentum happening. It'll be good for boss killing. What's in the drum mag? I assume it's all PP or BP. Just like an audio glitch or not?
Can't make this shit up right now. Good thing you have all this free space. <laughs> All right, a triple, got a triple. I, I wish we were on that task where you had to get the um the twenty kills on on lighthouse. We'd be we'd be nearly done. We'd be on the way to lightkeeper. They need to fix the pop, player pop sound. It's actually game breaking. That's why this guy just died. Basically, gave it away, and it's a directional two, which is even worse. But it wasn't in the direction of him, because he was like on my front right, and it sounded like it was near the extract. But I do agree, they do need to fix it. All right. Why is that? Ah, shit. Oops. All right, so I think we just buy another one. What do you think? two more the reason why I clicked skier too is because it used to be skier two to buy euros oh it might be one per reset What's next reset an hour away? All right. All right. Um. Far out. Too long. Moist. The amount of chonkers we're running into is insane.
Please look, thanks to the five gifted, bro. Five. We've got that now. Bro, slow down. You're going to get a speeding ticket. Dude, this is... This has actually been nuts. What's that task for Lighthouse where it's like kill players? I've, I've killed seven USAC, <laughs> but can't find a vertex. Look at our backpack stack. Actually, we put some guns in here. Yeah, the gun rack's mostly full, though. It's only three squares free, then. All right. This is why I want to get Len Lease done, because then I can start using these Untars and I'm not holding onto them. <sighs> we go back for Sturman. I think we just keep going Lighthouse now. We need to lose some kits. So I'll just go geared into Lighthouse. I think that's the way of doing it, because we go for Sturman. We're going in there to collect. Uh, what's his name? The only thing I'm worried about is if we go into Lighthouse and we run into the goons, it doesn't count towards our quest progression because we didn't have Sturman, Killer, and Rishala done. What do we do? What do we do? You have face mask for Packer? Um, I do. But I'd rather get that done for on, on factory. Let's go one more lighthouse. I need to go to the bathroom, so I'll be back in a sec. Protector up. I run the ads on the loading so you don't miss any of the raid. Pestily stand, pestily stand, pestily salute, pestily salute.
protect her. Oh, it's the one on the hill, isn't it? How late am I? A little bit. The guy's probably already come through. Did you hear someone run past? This is actually a really good spot to get a couple of kills for um, Easy Job Part 2. I might go get two kills and then just go back to hunting vertexes. <sighs> Mr. Ripper, thanks for the 18 months. I still hate Shoreline, but I kind of like it on my scav runs. Last run, I just, a few minutes ago, produced... A Ledex on a radio tower on top of the right empty cabinets roll. With the tool spawn, I think a loud thing to the Lord of Ballistics. <laughs> Worried me that was an M4 spawn then. This game then. trouble brews. The fact that the M4 shot means this guy's probably off the tower. Yeah, he's already dead. He's already dead. They're already dead! Oh no, he's not dead. Never been able to hit that one on the run from behind. He's too fast. Alright, now we leave. Our job here is done. One less kill to worry about. about those scams is they make it so hopefully there's no players just in this forward section at least give me a suggestion for a gun to use on, for a custom trade a shotgun wearing a shunker and a scav vest it's really unique not many people do it preferably a 133 or a 153 shotgun you can use a 155 if you're really keen What was that podcast you were talking about the other day about the make a list of all the things you can't give up and that more successful people would? What? Make a list of all the things you can't give up. Loving the series, Pest. Thanks.
Oh, I think it was Chris Williamson. It was a, it was a thing where it's like, it was Chris Williamson and the dude with the beard that always wears hats and doesn't wear shoes. I know it doesn't narrow it down a lot, but pretty much they said, write a list of all the things that you're not willing to give up. And then that's the list that those are the things stopping you. Well, th those are the things where more successful people are just willing to give up everything. So a very interesting thing is like, when I started content creation, I feel really nervous going up on this hill with being a bear. Oh my God, get on. So when I started content creation, I didn't do anything. All I did was make content. Like YouTube videos, all those kind of things. And, um... When, uh... You know, like I didn't go to birthday parties, funerals, weddings. I missed it all. I just said, nah, gotta work. And in hindsight, when I look back at it, it's like... That's what's made me stand out so much, you know? Like... I, I never took days off. I worked as hard as I could. As creative as, creative as I could. Nice. And there'd be other people like taking weekends off. And... This has been the first season of Hardcore I've watched. It's very entertaining and I'm almost caught up on YouTube. Thanks for doing these vids. All right, dude. And yeah, it did pay off. But I would say that I did miss a lot of life. Like... Standing out here. How did you find your niche? Find what you're good at and then be the best at that. I feel like I'm pretty decent at. Um, Helping people. So I said, you know what? I'm going to make the best guides possible for Escape from Tarkov. Literally make it the best. And at the time, there wasn't really a lot of guides going out. So it wasn't hard to become the best at it. But I just made sure that if there was a thing to make a guide on, I made it. And I just caught, tried to always... I made my first 500 videos, right? I tried to make it so my every video I made, I tried to learn a new skill and tried to improve. I'm gonna go across the Marin. I think it's a bit risky. Pretty good gun. My stash isn't full enough.
there any vertex spawns in this building that aren't in safe? Rocky77, thanks for 23 months. Scale Mecca, thanks for the prime. Hello, Banana Sir Mantana, Pastor thanks for 19 months. So excited to see Kappa on Harcourt. Mint Scorpion, thanks for 15 months. Left building of playground. Them spawn on chairs. Left building of playground. Behind me. One? Or is it like two? One, wouldn't it? The chairs on the outside or the inside? Is now the right time to say that I think I want to make this relationship serious with you? Less than three, Pretty but wrong. always more than two. Look, I think we need to find other people. You're being a bit too full on for me. I'm sorry. You're rushing things. Scope coming. So I have been a sub for 200 years but Twitch messed up. It would be cool to receive a cosmetic for completing Kappa every year. Or, you know what I think they should do? And it's even simpler and cool. It's do a feat of strength. So, every time there's a wipe, if you've got the capture during the wipe, you get a feat of strength achievement. So it's not, it's not counted towards a 100% achievement like list. I'm going to die here, aren't I? Killed this guy before as well.
might make it possible. But did the Maldona not go through? Oh, it did. Okay, we're good. I'll get rid of that. I think we should be able to regen now. Okay, cool. I want to take out the armor plate. Why don't you get nade? Oh, I'm too heavy. Hello? Excuse me, sir. After 38 months, I can't think of anything else to say besides, thank you for all you do. You're a good egg. Thanks, man. Don't need that. It doesn't have to be a lot, just a little bit. What do I drop? What do I drop? What do I drop? A drink? Let's just get rid of that. That has to get me under. Nope. Oh, fuck. There we go. I keep the Wi-Fi camera on me, so if I go into street and the door quest is open, I can hand it in. And I'll, that's why I always have one on me, just in case. Spooky wagons, thanks for the four months. Insane snowball. What did I start with? An AK. AK-103 with a, a PSO. The Rage Mage, thanks for 20 months. Congrats, Sniper.
Another quest done. Do, 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 do. Overpopulation. Who has that one? Overpopulation. Peacekeeper. And we got one kill towards, um, we got one kill towards easy job part two. Ugh. Progression. Oh, we got long road kills too. That was actually a really good raid. Progression all round. We need to go to, um, do reconnaissance at some point. Such a simple task. Leave, I love F alone. <laughs> no. All right. Um. We are getting to the point where we should go factory, but how do one, how does one go factory when there's no room to put all his stuff in here? Sell stuff. Excuse me? Did you just say I should sell stuff? Do you have any idea how many years of hard work I have put in to collecting all this trash? All right, we got four for long road. Still haven't got reconnaissance done. Easy job. Got an extra kill. And we've pretty much finished Lighthouse besides getting those vertexes. I have an idea. I actually have a decent idea. All right, I know what I'm going to do. I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to go for killer. Long line. 45. If we go for killer, then die. <laughs> well, this gun actually can kill killer. So that's why I'm happy to kill killer. But yeah, um, if we go for killer and die, then at least we lose all that. What what was all what's with all the doubters?
the way people have been playing interchange. That's why. Laying down in corners. Yeah, but I'm looking for killer. I'm not going to be sitting around waiting in corners. We have so many backpacks. Like, if we wanted to just farm money for a little bit, we'd be making a bank. Making bank. Didn't you kill him with the Toz once? Yeah, when you could... Um, stun lock him in the leg. I'll let my message cost about the right amount, right number of channel points. I think you'll kill Killer and get three Chads on the way out. I don't know. I don't think so. Dude, if I can get Killer in his helmet, I'd be so stoked. Yeah, we got the line. It's uh, the scav case is upgrading at the moment. MTB underscore R N. Come on, give us killer. Do us a solid. Forty three, forty two, forty one. Lag. So what are we doing here instead? Do we have anything else? Check jackets for Emicon key. Jackets and filing cabinets for Emicon key. That's the only other thing we have on any change. Camp Intercom, Emicon. Maybe I should ask players. Excuse me, do you have Emicon? Mr. Scav? Another option would be to farm some PSUs so we can get Bitcoin farm. This rig does hold two PSUs in the uh, in the rig. Any other jackets around this area that I don't know of or I can't think of? Also, tar cola hot rods. One in generic.
What do I need? Hot rods. One more squash. Is herring needed? It's herring, isn't it? These are blue armors. Juice. There's five herring, so that's the herring done. <sighs> it's not stories. Sounds scary, I'm getting out. I know it would take ages, but it would be worth long term to go through all the gunsmith parts to clear space. It would take so long, bro. Plus, a lot of the time I'm, I do like backwards ways of getting stuff done. Oh my god, that's nice. Alright, let's deeper, deeper that. You are right. Death is unavoidable. Have fun with it. Hastily, <laughs> <laughs> why aren't you dead? I keep voting on you to die. Well, what's going on? Dude, this morning, I have... I have been slapping. Lighthouse, I've just been putting on farm with players. It's been great. One, two, three. We saw this for a sec. Okay, what does the humpback or the sauris trade for? There's definitely a barter trade. All right, sauris are useless, so we can get rid of all of them. And we've already got five herring, so the herring can go too. Are they used for anything? That's it. So all these herring can go. Oh, I should say no, I need these five. All right. 
the stories are useless. Tarkola is good. Max Energy is good. Hot Rod's good. Squash good. All right. Sort. We've got four squash, five herring. So there's five squash, four tarcola. What's the beef used for? BTMO. Well, let's get that now. You have stray hot rods in your rigs, yeah. That's not gonna change much moving it to the holodeal neck. Alright, that can go as well. Alright. Are these used for anything anymore? Rotor nine mils. Do I want them? I only have four. Oh, these can go in here anyway. These can go, and we'll put this in here so it's a backup rig. Right. So, four Tarkola, we've got the five herring, the five squash. All we need is six more hot rods and one Tarkola. Therapist resets in 20 minutes, so we can buy our thing then. Right, and we got an SVD. Hey, where the fuck are we gonna put this? Part of me really wants to go factory. Just trying to figure out how I'd make it work. I don't even need to go factory. I could just go lighthouse again. <laughs> and then just play it normal. If I go factory, I can just get it done though.
What gun? I use the AK. I need to take a second mag. Let's just beep here the whole way. We can be a little bit cheeky in this. If there sounds like a really sweaty guy in there, we could just go to the rafters. Let's just hope we got some guys trying to tank their KDs. <laughs> Where are my Gamba addicts, chat? Hmm? Where are my Gamba addicts? Owning Throne, thanks for the 28 months, dude. Morning, Frank. Is that a packer? It is. Network provider part one is the beginning of the light cube quest line, quest line, right? Yeah. I actually feel like I'd be able to get to it pretty quickly. Broadcast part two is done. Bullshit's done. Cargo's done. Decontamination's done. Drug trafficking's done. Oh, gunsmith. Gunsmith 15. House arrest one's done. Living high is not a crime part two's done. Peacekeeping mission on one quest away from. Blood of War Part 3 is done. Forest Clearing is done. Punisher 5, this is what I'm doing right now. And Tarkov Shooter 7. So Gunsmith 15 and Tarkov Shooter 7 is literally the only thing that would stop me from being able to do Lightkeeper Unlock on... Uh, on... Hardcore. Agro Fluffy. Thanks so much for the 9 months. Pro Tagix. 81, thanks for the 11 months. Have you thought about swapping to IEM? No. Kind of want to be cheeky here. There's a guy running around trying to throw nades at people. I 
haven't done this in such a long time. But for a bit of fun. Hopefully I get the clearance. This used to be like what everyone used to do, sit up on the rafters. It was a much smaller map back then. My head was even out, he killed me. It's insane. It's all right, we need to get rid of some of the space. Stuff. Do 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 Left side peak sucks, yeah. No oh, total wash you got one, yeah, exactly. Morning, sweets. How you doing? Oh, wrong one. Right. Do we still have those shotguns? Didn't we have like a really nasty shotgun? By nasty, I mean like just destroyed. I don't think I have a lot of MP7 mags. Oh, we got a couple. Cool. But we don't need a lot. We just got to get three kills. Uh, two kills, sorry. Don't think we have a probe it'll do we? No. We got an adrenaline actually. That could work. Do we have any more MP7 mags? Good way to get rid of some uh, some stuff, though.
Ich kann ein Maxi. Two kills. So we need. Two kills and a dream. All right, let's do this. I'm doing Punisher part five right now. Moist pest for the Break next four. hardcore wipe. Can you think about a heart rate monitor and all right tracker? Love the content. Thanks for all you do. All right, I'm gonna no balls this. Some weird angle. If you do that head peek like that, they can't even see you there. It's like... Go, 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 go. <sighs> Need the Malboros and the bats and the mechanical parts. It's nice of him. Couple more guns. And a quest done.
Does your back ever hurt during the streams? Uh, how do you deal with it if so? I have a really good ergonomics office chair. If you're going to spend eight hours a day sitting on a computer chair, you should invest in a decent one at least. Right. I think that leads to a box case. It does. Oh, 120 rounds of BP and a pistol case. Nice. All right, punish six. All right, let's get these dog tags sanded in. 10, 9, 7, 2, 7, 6, 9. Done. And then we'll hand in these ones. Do, 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 do. 11, 12, 12, 13, 14, 14, 11. Cool. Which, not that we're going to do it, but we probably end up finishing it. Let's just hand in these. Anything under 20. Let's do anything under 20. And we don't have to worry about dog tags being all lit up. Lit up! Alright, 15 SVD kills. This one is going to be a rough one. We need to find SVDs. If we hear an SVD shooting and we're not using one, or even if we are, we should be trying to find the person with the SVD. That's, that's the kind of shit we need to do to get this quest done. Um, I do want to try and progress with Lend Lease now, just so we can get these Untars out. And then from that point onwards, we don't really have any gear required Thanks for the items content, to hold on Pestily to. Stan. These lower half masks can go now too, which is nice. One less thing to worry about. Do we keep using the Packer 6B? Or do we just go, you know what, you've done your bit. Off you, off you go, mate. I might sell that. I might sell that. No gear fear, go full Chad. I don't have gear fear. It's just like deleting that is just a wasted bit of gear, you know? I'll come back to that in a sec. Um... Moist. Haven't had the chance to play this wipe much. Only got to level 5 or so. But still love your videos and streams. Much love from KY Brother. Where's KY? Kentucky? All right, we could make this one a customs one. So, gas station safe. 220. 
GDASC, Directors, 104, 114. How we'll just chuck the other one in there. I'm missing a 204 key. We could even make an interchange too if we put Pharmacy in there. I feel like we could also make it reserve because this is all shoreline and streets. And this is streets and shoreline. So we put reserve in there too. Oh no, because they're in the gingy, aren't they? It's like a full, it's a four in that. All right, so we'd go this with, and we'd replace this one. That's how we do it. So this is customs reserve. And then we take that in with us. And then this is shoreline, shore streets. Wait, what? I stuffed that up. This one is Shoreline Streets. Shore Streets. Two. This one is Customs Reserve. And we'll make it purple. And then we make these two purple. Cool. That's just streets. The colors should match up now. Dorm 204 was right there. Really? It is. <sighs> cool. Uh, that's a reserve key as well, actually. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Look at us guy. What are we going to put in this? Let's put it as gear. All right, I think we go back to Lighthouse. Try and get this Lend Lease done. How many hours do you reckon you have in game across all accounts? Just seen someone with 14,000 hours. So you know this thing here, this got reset in like 2018. 2018 or 2019, this, this hours thing got reset so like there's a whole year of me playing this game and was one of my busiest years that doesn't actually have it i think i've streamed like 12 or thirteen thousand hours a stupid amount of hours but i don't know it once you get to a certain point it it, it doesn't doesn't really matter why like, you got to understand like this is my seventh year streaming and you know if you work a normal 40 hour week doing 
um, a 40 hour week doing, uh, you know, a standard year, 50 out, 50 weeks, you're looking at 2000 hours a year. So I've done 12,000 hours minimum, just if I did a 40 hour week. Now I have not done a 40 hour week. I've done more like 60 to 80 hours nearly every week. But it still is poor man's landmark. What do you mean by that? Yeah, I, I don't know how many hours of, I think I've streamed Twitch Tracker Pastilli. I've streamed probably 12, if not 13,000 hours. And then on top of that, I've got all my raid series and YouTube content I've done off stream. Twelve thousand two hundred hours I've streamed of Taco. Um, all right, let's go. I think we'll just keep doing Lighthouse. I, I am tempted just to use other gear, though. I can keep that helmet, but I'm going to use this armor. We don't need to use a packer, so let's not. And just for some random reason, if we go to do reconnaissance. I'll, pu I'll put this out there, chat. I'll put this out there, chat. If you go into other people's chats and you dis, dis streamers, from, and you're from a different community, it shows more about that streamer's community than the streamer streaming, if that makes sense. So for example, if like if one of my viewers goes into like Glorious's chat and be like, oh my God, you're nothing like personally. You make me look bad by doing that. All right? You make me look bad by doing that. Because it just makes it look like I have a toxic community. So if people want to come over for some other people's chats and come in here and be like, oh, you're nothing compared to so-and-so, it really makes that person look bad. Even though you think you're doing something like, um, you know. Except Aqua, we can't make him look bad. Aqua's lovely. Holy crap, that was a fast load in. All right, let's do it. Mm. Long road, reconnaissance, vertexes. Long road, reconnaissance, vertexes. Anything else? Reconnaissance vertexes.
All right, chat. Move on about talking about other content creators. And... You might know, like. I don't really care about talking about other content creators, but then like commenting that their content's good or bad, and that is, it's, like I said, it's just, it just makes me look bad while you guys are doing it. Well, now we find fucking lions. Thank you. Do for I even all need a lion anymore? Do I just toss this? Really helped me get better at this game. Love you, pest. A car, little wave lol. Thanks for 700 bits, dude. No worries, man. Dox case. Ugh. I suppose I probably could. So we clean up the keys a little bit. Get one more dox case. I think I actually have the cats and the uh, horses as well. Cats in the cradle and the silver spoon. Little boy blue, the man on the moon. And show my age there, aren't I? Cables turn into faulties. So they're attacked. I'm going to take the bird because we can. I actually think we might just end up going for the, the stash space. The annoying part right now is I don't have the U-set key. I only have the hillside key. And cannot catch a break when it comes to the vertexes. Sorry, Dan! Happy? There's more than one. We might as well reset though. This is the problem. The vertexes are gone. 
At least the pro kills half an M4. What if they have the vertexes and they're in their butt? In their booty. We did all right. We checked like seven spawns and got a heap of loot. I'm not going to water treatment to try and get the vertexes. One, I don't really know all the spawns, and two, it's uh, I would have to clear through the whole map, particularly if I spawn on this side. I'd have to clear through the whole map to check. So. We got into this raid in like a minute and a half. Hopefully we can get another quick load in. The lion is a... Uh, is uh, probably all we need for a dox case. So that's good for that. Clear up the sash a bit more. And then also on top of that we've got a pro kill which is half an M4. Which is we need for um, peacekeeping mission when we finally do get all these vertexes. And then... No one there. The bird and all that can sell. Okay, that's half an M4. There's cells that's a, needed for a bolty. That's for the docks case. Can't remember what we use skull rings for. There is a barter trade for them. <sighs> Veritas is the sword, and there you go. It's worth holding on to all that. And another Yusek kill. Jeez, I missed all the first shots and only got him once in the head. Should I just sell Black Key Card from Therapist if I never run labs? Are you going for Kappa? Because I would hold on to it for samples and... Um, if you want to get lead X's, it's a nice, quick, and easy way. Skulls for money case. Could get a money case and get rid of all the... Well, money case also holds, um, GP coins and Bitcoins too. Hmm. We just need that line. Let's do it. Alright, so that is reserved. I think we make Shoreline its own thing. Right, so that's shoreline. This is just streets. Bedroom Conference Skybridge. So Shoreline's got its own thing. Streets. 
Customs Reserve. Oop, wrong button. Morning, Banksy. How you doing? <sighs> What's the other item needed for this? ES lamps. Two military cables. ES lamps. It's kind of pointless. All right, we can sell the eggs. It says three parrots for an armor. Yeah, hold up to parrots then. <clears throat> kind of tempted just to leave the keys out now. I'll put them here like this. And we can fill this full of other stuff. Put them in there. Look at us go. Need more BP ammo. Time to pull out the SVD? No, no. Not yet. I'm trying to figure out how I want to do the SVD kills. We need to be very careful with them because they're not easy to get. Uh, was I in Australian Special Forces? I was not. No, I was in the infantry. This is the one we are going to get. I can't believe it. This is the one we're going to get um, vertexes. I'll be oats time. That's why I'm going to do the ads on the loading so you don't miss any of the raid. Would this be your second time getting Kappa on hardcore? Yes. GLHF. We've got to get it though. There's a long way to go. Um, sorry, I was just checking something real quick. Gonna stop my oats. Protect.
You know, since when's Pesley playing EFT again? I missed the time he played it. So glad he's back. I've been playing Tarkov now for seven years, bro. Where have you been? Been here the whole time. Takes one day off. Next minute, he's quit to hit Tarkov. How's your dad doing? Good. The best way you killed a PMC in the last round, I did. Dude. Did it, did it, did it, did it. Ugh. Add tax. Inverted comms, next to 21 months. It's a horrible spawn for us. We're gonna be so late to chalet. And unless I run straight across, which puts me very vulnerable. Like literally everywhere. This is the worst spawn in the game. Oh, in Lighthouse. Second worst, actually. The one that you get trapped in is probably the worst. Hopefully, you guys are finding the Lighthouse raids entertaining because we've done a lot. I tried to mix it up with some wood stuff, but I really want to get the vertexes now for the peacekeeping mission. So we can take advantage of that. The other option is to go woods. Try and farm Sturmy. This is an S house. There are many like it, but this one is mine. Not being an ad whore pest. I run ads. I just do it on the loadings. That way you don't miss the raids. This is where, like, my fear of going for Kappa will become a little bit more, uh, the word it becomes a little bit more annoying because there's just going to be times where I just have to farm vertexes right and I have to do it over and over and over again and my fear is the YouTube will get very mundane and boring thankfully we've had some good fights but you get the point like <clears throat> we got lucky with the keys on shoreline boy did we get lucky You know what I forgot to do? Forgot the tick off that we did Punisher Part 5 on my spreadsheet. It's saying 49 still. I thought we did eight yesterday.
dude there. It's hiding there in the grass. I think he's waiting for people to run up or down. Oh no, I'm in a shitty spot. Checked. Oh, I didn't do that. <clears throat> it's all looted. Not a single item. So that's the audio bug then. Yeah, someone just on the side there. Pestily moist. I came in with a motherfucking grenade launcher. <sighs> Sam, thanks so much for the 44 months. Maximum effort, thanks for 26 months. I still think there's a guy camp in the road. Was Kappa on Hardcore done before? I've done it season five. What do you think we do? I can't push these guys. These guys are going to insta kill me. <sighs> Go around the left, maybe? What about this? Could be a good raid to get long line, a long, long line. No, long road. Good day, mate. Smile. We could try and get some long road kills, and then maybe go over to get reconnaissance done.
Right. And then over. Just give away my whole fucking position. My whole plan. Now I have a busted arm too. Yeah, with a bright red spot next to me on a rock. This is so stupid. He's gonna lob a noob tube, noob tube at me. Noob tube? Tube noob. Friend has issues. Why is he picking on my friend? I wasn't talking about you. Why is he picking on my friend's friend? I believe they counted towards Long Road. I should have. Yep. Only nine to go. Yay. Nothing. Not a single scab. Less than three. Schnapper, thanks for eight months, dude. Learn to swim, thanks for eight months. Ed Honcho, thanks for the prom. The worst part about um, Long Road is as a bear, you can't really go over the hill and shoot him down the other side of this because you get hit by the ATS.
Okay, I'll just try to breach a door. Vodka. Oi, that was a headshot. Oh, now they know I'm here. Thanks for that, bro. They see me rolling. Been the two guys from before. <clears throat> that scab shooting ruined it. I wasn't even going to loot him either. These kind of deaths seem unfair. Well, I shouldn't loot in the open on with a hill looking over it. It was a good place to find moonshine for scab case. I would say um, craft them if you're talking about or buy them either. Uh, I found them on streets, woods. Where else have I found moonshine? Streets and woods are the main ones. Just thinking about rushing through the chalets to get the vertexes. What's the other option? Vertexes don't spawn in labs. We're finished with the reserve, aren't we? We just need to kill Gluhar now. Man. It's all pretty much boss killing and sniping. We could try doing reserve. See if we can get Gluhar to spawn. We're actually getting a decent collection of snipers. The problem with this loadout is I'm going to have to kill a couple of these boys and then... ...to kill some of these boys and then um, use their guns to finish them. Grab my breakfast.
I haven't seen the bosses much. In the woods raids we did, we didn't get any Sturmans. Haven't seen any clue highs. I always get hungry watching you eat your oats. You could eat oats then. Nah, that's the that's a different emo, a uh, different uh shirt. I was wearing the uh, moist, the moist shirt. Oh, this is a really bad spawn. Plays to my left and right. I just gotta hope I can get in there before I get clapped. I want to see some crazy shit. Let's go. Let's hope glue, glue car spawns. These boys. We need more meds? Nah. We're good. Was there lag? I wasn't paying attention. It's not an easy gauge on this map. Oh. There's a grenade box on the bottom floor here. Oh, please be Emicon. It won't be, it'll be like an MP key. Jim Trickington, thanks for 27 months. Cheater in this raid, I'm 100% dead. I don't remember where all the grenade boxes are. Alright, what the fuck was that? Okay, would that be? We got RBST.
Emicon, maybe? If we find a third key, I'm probably more inclined to run out. Hello? Blue car is so elusive, this one. What do you think? dead scab there. Hello? Maybe that was someone shooting a scab from the, the top. Yeah, there's someone in the middle of the dome. I'm 90% sure. There's 100% there's a dude just standing up there going back and forth, left and right. Really hope we got some good keys then. Please be Emicon. It should, might be the police car key. Yeah. This is, I'm not sure. KSM. I was thinking it could be KSM or SMP. TB. I think that's in the basement bit. Uh. Police is lighthouse, but.
it's pretty much a dead K. Let's put pharmacy in there. And that one. Cool. Let's go again. What do you want? What do you do when you feel burnt out gaming and games just don't seem to be fun at the moment? I go outside. I live life a little. I go fishing. I go hiking. I go for walks. I just do other things. Watch a movie. Read a book. Learn a new skill. Work in my garden. Okay, Pess, I'm losing my mind trying to kill Colin. Uh, my gun jammed four times after killing his guards. How does one bypass this shit? Don't use a shitty gun. Boss to BG, thanks for the six months. Colin is probably one of the easiest bosses to kill. They don't push you, really. The first, like, you might get one or two guys to push you at the start. The rest of it's just throw some grenades and just easy kill. His baton makes it jam? What? Really? I've never had my gun jam when I've been fighting him. If he hits you, your gun jams. I've, he's never ran at me. Ever. He's been dead before he got near me. Mr. Hey, Pest, how's it going? Good, mate. Thanks for the 16 months. Uh, Smash Brown, Gl glad you're enjoying it, man. What's going to be our strategy if we can't find the Emicon key? Just wait in interchange until someone's open opens it, hopefully. sense the whole shadow thing it's like it's independent from the gun
Do we bother checking the other side? I think we're getting to the point where snipers are actually becoming, like we've got a fair, fair bit of uh, stuff to start doing some sniping. Hey guys. Hey mate. Official gamer number one, thanks for six months. I guess we could check for another graphics card, hey? No, nah, we didn't get Emicon. Throw the grenade around here. I might go under. Check for hot rods. Uh, there's like 25 guns in this place. Sugar? Are we done with them? It's to make moonshine. We can make our own moonshine if we take the sugar. I suppose it's worth it. Scabs upstairs. Oh, he's here. He's here. Be at the back of the building, please don't be at the back of the building. Where is he? Which building? Second floor. Is a 
grenade on the windowsill. Is it this room? Just got destroyed. Six hits that was. <laughs> it was the left side peak. I'm blaming the left side peak. Didn't give me enough time to take the shot. That was him, yep. Yeah, bosses are bullshit. Zero recoil. Ah, oh, man. He pushes after one guard. Not normally. I was just, yeah, I, I was probably a little bit impatient. I was afraid that someone would come after I threw that nade. Oh, that's all we've got. That's all we need. Need a heavy bleed. There was one more mag. Cheers, guys. Nah, we're getting him now. Let's go morning. Time to stop up, I think. So I spend 10 minutes an hour loading into raids, right? If I could make it that I could use my treadmill for that 10 minutes every time we load in, but I could still talk to you guys. And I did eight hours of streaming. There's a, there's a good chance I'd be able to walk an hour and a half a day. Get a desk treadmill? No. I literally have a treadmill set up right there at the moment. I can't really show you, but I could put a camera on the staircase, go on the treadmill, and then oh, that wouldn't be too hard to mount either. I could use one of the Elgato mounts on the staircase. And then I put the cable across to there, and I just put chat up on a tablet, and then lapel microphone. I 
think I'd be able to do it. I don't think it'd be too difficult. The only issue would be the microphone section. I'd have to have a lapel for every load-in, which would be really annoying to turn on and off for every load-in. Unless I left it on permanently. Okay, it's a USB there. I could plug the lapel into the USB and clip it to the actual treadmill. That would work. So I clip the lapel, leave it permanently on the treadmill, and I just mute and unmute it from here. And it would be always charged because it would be on there. Okay, okay. And then the only thing would be, I could see chat, but I wouldn't be able to see the stream. So I wouldn't know if I'd log load it in or not. Come on, give us, give us Glucker. Man, if I killed him, then that would have been so nice. What time does it lag? Well, there's no lag again. Someone's already throwing flashbangs over here. Just gonna walk because I wanna try and kill this guy. Hello? I'm looking for Glucker. The boss. Hello? Set. We're already in a raid geared. Two in a row.
Why is this door closed? He's outside. Is he outside or inside? Player on the other side over there somewhere. I'd rather try and save the SVD for another map. Like if we can find a player and we got a jump on him, sure, but. Checked Glucker's pockets. Is that everything for reserve now besides Shooterborn? We can do raiders on reserve, actually. Vertex is a rare here, bro. Like, I like your uh, optimism, but... Someone walking up. <sighs> That's good. The servers of the ball gave you your vertex up the top. You mean Coftums? It says Coolada. 15,000 XP. And an SVD, which is huge.
I would have cried if I died then. <clears throat> the best part about getting Glucker then is we can now get a... Um, weapon case from that. New, v new TV show for you to watch, Shogun. That is all. I think I've seen it. Like not the show, but I've seen the advertisement for it all like on the on the live streaming services. Is it on like Disney Plus in Australia? Hulu and Disney. Chuck Noob 32, thanks for six months. We should get new dog tags. We need, is it USEC ones? This is easy, because all we do here is we go sort. There shouldn't be any dog tags in these. Cool. What do we need for the next level? A rooster and a tech manual. Oh, you need power on for it to give the bonus? That's rude. Should I put items in here for um for Kappa? So we don't like use them? How come we can't put the plague mask in there? Um egg badge VHS. Easy book. Another book. Raven. Veritas. On G phone. Am I missing any? I think that's it. Pro kill's not a sh um, streamer item for collector. Neither is the, neither is the skull. Huge, huge task to complete. feel like we should put weapon parts in this over like if we filled up weapon parts in here and even here as well then the rest of the stash could just be oh but mm, i was gonna say we could get rid of a lot of these things but maybe we just keep these as guns Getting that kill then has made me want to go for more bosses. Oh. 
Hey Pest. Hey mate. Hope you're having a great day. I am. Keep up the good work. I think I think we go for Rashala. We just need the golden TT. Yeah, I'll update the spreadsheet in a sec. Should we go for Rishala? Go for the Golden TT? I think that'd be our best. Oh. <sighs> the only other option is like when we go, if we go customs, we take in. Um, We take in a sniper instead, and we try and snipe it all. We don't have any snipers. We, we can barter trade for them. It's either Sturman or it's Rashala we go for. We can actually go for Sturman like this and not try and snipe him. We go to the top of the mountain, get, grab a sniper off as well. Which one would give the better reward? Let's look at it like that. This would actually get us a money case. Lab key cards we're going to need later. It doesn't really make any difference, does it? We just got to go for one Can't of them. Can't believe it has almost been three years. How fast time flies by popper pest pest Brownies Maximus, thanks for the 35 months, dude. Appreciate it. Um, question, guys. Where is the goons right now? Because if they're on customs, I'd rather not go customs. Or if they're on woods, I'd rather not go woods. Shoreline? That works. All right. Let's give customs a go. Mix it up, you know? We haven't done a customs raid in a while. I'm gonna have to charge my uh my mouse sometime soon. Hi mouse, don't worry. Now I'm stuck here. I can't do anything. How's the heat been? We don't have air conditioning in our house. We've only got evaporative and it's, it's pretty horrible. Like to give, to give perspective, it got so hot in the house yesterday. I was just, I was like, let's go for a drive. So we have air conditioning. I'd be so miserable in Australia without air conditioning. So evaporative is good as long as it's not lots of days in a row that are hot. That's pretty much the main thing. It, ta it takes the edge off usually, but when you've got like four or five days in a row, it just does nothing. And we've had, I think it's going to be about 10 days above 30 degrees Celsius. Like we've had anywhere between 33 and 38 for the last like week. And we've still got like four days left of it. I think Thursday is a bit cooler. I think Thursday is going to be like 25 or 26, but then it goes back up. No, it's in it's autumn now. Summer's over. We've got a, we've had a very late summer. I did get Glucker. Slav. And we've got another SVD, which is huge. If we can get like five to 10 SVDs, I'll be pretty keen to go for some SVD raids. My USB, my USB. <sighs> Didn't bring any 
grenades in. So what's the timer for for Rashala? 38 as well. Lag. Okay. So, Emicon key spawns in here. Right there. I thought I had the gas station keys. Oh, pfft. Remember like a month ago and there was like no scatter spawning? Someone's at the gas station behind us. Alright, there's the one Tarkola we need. A bit worried about running over to here and stopping, so I'm just going to do that. Stronghold because we only get spawned by a player. They go around the right hand side here. Someone's still at big red. 
So that's kind of what I, I do a lot of, guys. That I think a lot of people that are new to the game would get a lot from ben like benefiting from trying to practice. And that's <clears throat> constantly listening to where all the gunshots are and what kind of gunshots. So they can get a picture of where people are around the map. For example, we heard a pistol shooting over at Big Red. So there's either a pistoling over there, a scav over there, or a guy with a suppressed gun. Like, you kind of just build those kind of pictures in your head. And then that way, you know, okay, if I go over near Big Red, I'm going to be worried about a guy with a suppressor and it's, it's like either really geared or there's going to be a pistoling. It's one or the other kind of thing. Any suggestions on Psycho Sniper? I usually do it on Factory. Running out of ammo. Let's take the shotgun. We can ditch the MP7 when we're done. So much room for activities. I think I'm going to get another item case just for the cover items. You have to survive after your last kill, though. What's this? Kind of want to go back to the lighthouse. I know I keep going back to it, but I keep thinking about how if we can get lighthouse done, If we can get lighthouse done, then we get um peacekeeping mission, and I can start getting rid of the blue blue armors. We just need these vertexes. <clears throat> Do any long range guns we can use? What's inside? Best way to find goons. Um, just ask chat and then go, where are the goons right now? And chat will go, shoreline. And then you go to shoreline. Or goon tracker. The website goon tracker and, and those ones. Um, M1A. 
We don't really have any long range guns. What's a good barter trade for like an SKS or something? I need something. We've got this one. No, nah, it's going to be a bit rough. I need something that I can kill the rogues with. I don't want to waste my bolties on that. Okay, gas analyzers are RFBs. This is actually not a bad idea. Start collecting up some gas analyzers. We could do M1As, but I want to save them for... Um, I want to save them for a test drive if we need them. OPSKS would be actually kind of solid. This doesn't have a amount to... Oh, it does have a dovetail. We need a weapon parts. All right, let's just farm vertexes and then we'll switch to that if we need it. Aftrum, thanks so much for the uh, three months. Your title is hardcore to Kappa, so what exactly you're doing to make it hardcore as doing Kappa alone is hardcore. Um, I'm not allowed to use flea market. I'm not allowed to use traders besides barter trades. Um, the only thing that I can put in my container is keys or things that hold keys. And... That's pretty much the main stuff. Yo, Pestoy, how you got all lab key cards? You bought them off flea market, and if you did, how you make so much money, or you found them all by yourself? I found green and uh, did the quest for black. The rest of it, I bought them all. Um, Bitcoin farm got me heaps of money. Outside of Bitcoin farm. Just playing the game, dude. The less you... Sorry, the more you survive, the more money you make, pretty much. You did get Kappa, yes? No, I still need John B. Glasses on my main account. Yeah, you're allowed to buy dollars and euros. Oh, and you're allowed to buy containers from traders. Otherwise, you'd never, like, when you got your standard account, it's fucked. And you start with a standard account as well. So, very early on, it was really hard to get um, any stash space. Bitcoin's going up in value has actually been god godly because we've been able to buy item cases. I'm even tempted to farm up the level four uh, stash. All right, what quest did we do just now? We did Jaeger's Razor Part One. I oh, already ticked it. Thirty-eight to go, chat. If we can get. A, a lighthouse raid to go right, and we could go to reconnaissance. That would be really nice. We still need to do Sturman Killer and Rashalda. That's going to be annoying. Any advice for playing lighthouse and not wanting to uninstall the game? Dude, I go through those same thought processes all the time. Lighthouse, it's rough. I wish I wish that was a nicer way of putting it. Is there a way to queue tier two kits on arena? I have five kits unlocked. Should be able to queue it then. 
You just got to click tier two instead of tier one. When you think will be the new in-game event? I'm not sure. Not too sure, sir. Can't find killer. Listen for his gun. His war cry. I'm going to do the ads now. I forgot to do it when it started loading, but hopefully you won't miss too much of the raid. Hello, I recently started playing Tarkov. Ammo or weapon is more important? Ammo. Ammo is more important than the gun. He streams on his channel sometimes, Bossy Tube. Oh man. Why does this game hate me so much? You know what? I'm going to run straight for the uh, shallow. I'm not going to do the lap around. And I guarantee you I'll get killed on the way, but at least we got it quickly done, you know? Papa. I don't want to go all the way around to the right and then have to go all the way over the mountain. Why do I get this spawn so much? I'm going to get sniped from over there. There's guys that spawns the helicopter. There's guys spawns on the hill over there. I don't mind the narrow map. But it's just, this spawn is quite rough to try and, like, do anything from. I don't have any heavy bleeds. Try and move quickly so we can actually get the vertexes.
big blank spot. Never find the three BTG or the other one. Come on, give us a vertex. All these stims, but nothing that we need. <sighs> Let's get pushing through. We've got Autumn. We've been looking for the 20 raids. Um, streets is really good for him, man. The Coftums. Unless you're talking about the mule. Does Eddie Murphy, Roar, and Delirious still hold up? Like, it's still as, as funny as when I watched it, like, 15 years ago. Pretty good. We know balls and go for Marin. I heard a shot over this side, but... Which chair? One, two, three, four, or five has the vertex spawn. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. One. That's not someone up on the tip, is it? One and five. There you go. There's something to the right. Single fire? That could that dude was a thousand percent on single Oh. He didn't have a mag in. He didn't have a mag in! He had me dead to rights. Not gonna lie. When I accidentally jumped then, <laughs> I thought it was dead. 
He had to have checked Marin Rock. Nothing. Sorry, mate. Happened to the best of us. Go do easy job too now. You ballsy. I could probably get a couple of kills if they're not already dead. I wouldn't do the whole reconnaissance though. Realistically, it's a nice gun, don't get me wrong. But we should, I think we should go check for a couple of easy job kills. The blue helmet. rare that someone does hillside though and also goes out to water treatment. Better say, it's, better say it's therapeutic watching you try and find these vertex. It's good to know it, it's not just me suffering these spawn rates. Yeah, but like, it's a bit weird, right? So you'll go, oh, I can't find a vertex, but then you'll find two in the one raid or, you know, like, oh, I can't get Glocka to spawn and then we got back to back raids. It's just, it's just how, how it works sometimes, you know? Do you ever do daily, weekly tasks on hardcore? All the time. It's really important to get your rep. I'm trying to get max traders. Oh, okay, they're up. This is bullshit. I'm going to die to that guy now.
started. Getting close to resetting. Nope. It's on the left somewhere. Evening from Scotland. All right, it's resetting. Thanks for, thanks for the eight months, dude. One more kill. My problem is now I'm coming like bait for fucking planes guys to come here. See what I mean? But these might have counted now. What was I on? Was I on two? So I'm on three now because of those ones. Can I get this fucking guy without getting beamed by the dude on the ground? How the fuck am I going to make this shot? Made me want to loot that guy now. His friend.
I can get the Raiders to push me. What the fuck was that? Cool, fine. Thanks for the five gifted subs. Next time you're coming to Norway, I hope we get better time for meetups. And better waiter. The one we had was rude. <laughs> Thanks for the nine months. We weren't happy, but we gave him so much business. We gave them a lot of money, but yeah, they were not happy when we came. This dude went along the edge. Hey man, is there any good loot on him? What's going on? I go to get we're gonna die here to the 50 count how I got easy job done last time. I literally just stayed here and all the player scavs came to me. I'll keep the 40 round mag. I think we're pretty much done with the actual MP7 actually. So I might just get rid of this whole mag. Do it this way. You can eat the sprats. A little bit of drink. I wonder if I could loot that body. Or 
awesome. I think we get rid of the helmet. This stuff's gonna be more useful. Big backpack. Do I need those tubes? Twenty months. Okay, so I'm gonna use this. Three. Fifty-three is pretty heavy, actually. Have meal, that's fine. He hates me. Freedom 499, thanks for 20 months, dude. Yeah, I might have to take that L11. The L12. Meldonin's running out. How long does it last? Drop shoddy? Oh, do I have shoddy ammo on me? Where? Oh, there. You get the wall finished, it's like less than a day from finishing.
That was a big raid. I don't really remember what we did. We got, what was that? Seven kills, the easy job. Killed a player on the road. Oh, imagine if that guy had a mag on. I would have been so dead. <laughs> So incredibly dead. Still no vertexes. I've already got the stims, the stims for samples. I just need our AHF1Ms and three BTGs. I usually usually get a vertex within five raids. Does this mean we can get another Dox Kings? Let's do it. And then there's no issues with keys. We just make one straight customs. Have a straight reserve one. We can use these keychains to be like. Overflow or something. Well, this mods will be those two because they are still the same one. Streets, so they're all streets keys. That's just reserved now. Pestily moist. Pestily moist. I want to save the grenades for boss farming because it just makes boss farming easier. I think that's pretty much all we need for there. Um, let's just put the grenades in here for now. Young Joseph, young Joseph Stalin. So I almost said young. Young Joseph Stalin. Thanks for six months. Pestle, you sure line not time the uh, only? It's tricky for me. What? Pestle, you sure sure line not time only? It's tricky for me. Um, what? No, you could go daytime short line.
That was still good. Like, even though we didn't really, it didn't look like we did much, like we didn't complete a quest, we still got um, a heap of kills for Easy Job Part 2. If we can get Easy Job Part 2 and Reconnaissance done, water treatment is totally, totally finished. Long Road is a little bit of farming, and then Vertexes. And then the only thing left to do on Lighthouse will be Shooter Born in Heaven. And we're still farming up more guns. I think what's going to end up happening is we're going to get all these boss kills done. We're going to get all that kind of stuff done and it'll just be all sniper stuff. So we just need to keep making sure we keep farming the items for sniper rifles. And if we, if we find a sniper, we use it. Or we, or we, we pick it up. Snipers and SVDs. All right, ads on loading so you don't miss any of the raid. I'm going to do a quick wee. I'm back in a minute.
It's a really good spawn for killing players as they're running in. Over here. How late am I? Same as last time I was. Grenade launcher shot a few rounds. I think this is the raid we try and do reconnaissance. I got a good spawn for it. You guys can try to explain to me where the vertexes are. So say I was looking out towards water treatment plant from like the bridge. There's the left, the right, and the back building, right? So left is that side, right's that side, back is that side. Which ones have vertexes in them? Left building. Oh, there's a car here that can have items as well. Inside this. There's a coffin. There's so many of them. First floor left cl corner, cl closest to door. Found mine in the right. I don't have any reason to go reserve anymore. It's completed. I can kill res uh, raiders in labs or in reserve, but it's not technically needed. Um, unless I'm doing shooter born in heaven, so we'll worry about that when we get to it. This guy's going to push us, most likely. That should put us on 11. Technically, I don't need to worry about doing easy job if I want to try and do reconnaissance. But, you know, if I can get an extra kill here, it's not going to hurt. Generally, when I want to try and get easy job done without too much issue, I kill those two guys I just killed and then I run back to doing other stuff. Because that will get you two kills. And you can just do that like 10 raids and then and it's done. Alright, I'm going to try to do reconnaissance. So someone said the right building as well. Vertexes can be found in each building. All right, let's hope we don't stuff this shot up. See that? He was looking at me. I think he actually went to take a shot then. Alright, where are they in this building then? Where do I find the vertexes in this building? Under projector, forklift box. 
Under projector forklift box. Forklift box. This one? I don't think any of these count towards easy job, unfortunately. Nope. Okay, where's the projector you guys are talking about? Under projector. I don't know, I don't know of any projectors. Next room. So here. Also, up on the catwalks, there is a box at random spawns. Is that one over there? Yeah, so I know those ones. Mm, not really the best ammo. But look, in case we get desperate, I'll put it here for now. Is that the only one? The audacity. The box. Now, let me just get this guy. An arm on him? My arm is broken. Untapped. All right, what box? Go okay, back to first room on left. That one there. Bunk room. Oh, okay, down here. What box? Left room cardboard box. First room, that's second. Check that. I'll check that box there. Fuck, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. <gasps> I think I saw him just as I. 
Chat, why'd you tell me to go back up there? Next building, two. Top tent in fold out box. Next building is two. Top tent in fold out box. You mean the, the tent on top of it? So we've killed two on this roof at least. Hurry up because the scabs will start coming soon. Left side of bed. Which bed? You don't care about your blacked up arm? Well, I don't have anything to heal it right now. Sir? I do care about it. I care about it a lot. Would be where that iridium spawn would be a vertex spawn as well. Survival kit in bunk room. In the previous building. I don't think there's gonna be much shot of me getting back there, bro. this Get it? Reconnaissance? Yeah, cool. Just let us pass and you won't Jeez, he die. sounds close. Thanks for streaming. No, I ask people to tell me where the vertex is spawned. I, I don't mind the back seating. I'm dead. Oh, I'm an idiot. Surprise, motherfucker. I'm empty. Not like this. I've got a family. Such a clean one tap too. Where whereabouts? Oh there, Acer. Open chest in front of you, a vertex wand as well. What open chest? 
Uh oh, there's a scav on their way. This one. Trim it all. We're gonna have to use this, aren't we? Right. These gas mods are going to be horrible for us. Say there was a survival kit in here in the bunk room. Valdane's to the Elcan on the bed, yes. Talking about that laptop. if I can. Alright, I think there's two raiders on top of the building. So we're going to have to deal with them. There's also a box, also in a box north of the last building. Uh, Vertex Morn. I want to try and get reconnaissance done this game, so... I've got a minute to kill the guys on the top of my building, and then... I'm going to have to drink that hot rod. I'm just spring for it. Hopefully that guy doesn't beam me from across the other side. Right. 
I did think about putting the rig in here, but honestly, I don't think I'm going to survive this raid. Best can you dude? All right, here we go. Full sprint down. Then we're gonna run all the way around. Daddy Pest, we must know the, the crucial side. answer. Yeah, na ya, or na ya na. By your choice, ye <sighs> shall be judged. Well, it depends if you want a yes or a no. Yeah, na yeah is a yes, and na ya na is a no. I'm, I'm in more of a yes man than a no man, so I'd be like, yeah, nah, yeah. You know what I mean? Hi. Actually, I'm going to go inside, and there's usually a bit of food at the back left. Hey, how you doing? Less than two. Hey mate, what's going on? Why do you try to breach that? Chat, did you know there's a falling cabinet back here? Uh, they don't care. We're gonna be at the front. Hello? I think he's on top, right? Milk. Is there any more spots chat in this building for vertexes that I missed? Or was it just on the roof? These crates are usually like vertex crates. Moist. If it's okay to ask, 
How come you're not in the team anymore? Just doing our own thing now. That's it. That simple. Everyone pretty much stopped playing Tarkov when we were just doing our own thing. So. Stairs to the left. Stairs to the left. To the left, to the left. We're about. Top. Like on top of here, along the walkway. Focus chat. Hi guys. Oh god. Welcome bad. to my stream. And without further ado, let's go. Thanks, thanks to Ray. Have an amazing good. stream, dude. Is that the only spot chat? Do you recommend your headset or would you try something different if they break? Oh, I love this headset. Dawn TV, nice. Where did you find a vertex? Can spawn all tech items on the blue shelves. You found, a, you found it on the blue shelves. Don't think I, if I if there was vertexes spawning on these shelves, I would have known about it. Because I, I I generally look at these shelves every time I come in here. I'm not saying that you're lying. I'm just saying they must be rare. They are. Oh shit! Are we that late in the raid? All right, we need to get to the last building. I found vertex and GPU on those. Okay. I I, I believe you. Must be super rare though. I don't play a lot of Lighthouse anymore. You don't have to do recon at all in one raid? Yes, but I'm already here. All the rogues are pretty much dead. So it just makes more sense to try and get it done. Like, even if I die, at least the quest is done, you know? I don't have to come back over here. Are there any vertexes on the roof of this building? I'm going to go up to the roof first to get the quest done. Not on roof? Okay, cool. See anyone running down there? Dead. Rogue beam me. That's all right. Reconnaissance is done. We don't have to worry about that quest anymore. Dog. I died to dog. I recommend looking at Tarkov Help. Tarkov Help ver Vertex. There's 202 spawns on streets? I call bullshit. 
It doesn't spawn on streets at all. It, it literally does not spawn on streets at all. Not in duffel bags, not in sports bags. The only two places they spawn is here and reserve. I've 100% found a vertex on streets. They don't spawn in toolboxes and sports bags. EFT wiki vertex. Sports bags, dead scabs, weapon boxes, ground caches, buried caches. See, wiki doesn't say they spawn in toolboxes. And the wiki, they data mine their shit. Like they're allowed to. If they spawn in toolboxes, they'd be. This. Uh, anyone want to buy some villas in Abu Dhabi? <sighs> now, do I need to go back and survive a raid for that task? I assume so. Yeah. Cool. I think we'll just focus on chalets now. <laughs> One of the kills got counted towards the uh, thing. So we need eight more kills uh, for easy job. Why don't we just, for the memes, SV98. I don't think we have a suppressor for one, though. No. Nah. We've got the thread for it. We just don't have the suppressor. Three times, nine times. This would be a weird way of doing it, but let's do it. <laughs> I've never done it like this before. All right. We probably should save the SNB for killer, but... Close range slash wrong, long range. We got this covered. All right, we're in there for the vertexes. Take a little tiny bit of ammo just in case. We're gonna be so loud. Oh. Bring a CMS. I don't think I have any. I got, I got, okay, I got two. Have you got Capra on Hardcore before? Season five was the last time.
What's left to do? Exclamation mark. Um, task left. You'll be able to see what 38 tasks to go. We're kind of working on Lend Lease Part 2, Easy Job Part 2, Reconnaissance, Shooter Born in Heaven, Tarkov Shooter at the moment. Right. <clears throat> uh, go Kubi Bla Blazon. Thanks for the 10 months, by the way, dude. Hum. For this, I would normally sit up here. Maybe we just wait for a minute and just see if we can get a kill or two. This is not a good sight. But we'll make it work, I guess. The sun's not doing us any favours either. To. Long road. Well, now we're in a bit of, bit of a pickle because people know we're up here. Nice suppressed shots we just did. No one will ever suspect us here. Should do the easy job bit. Kill the front guards, the easy job. Kill, get a couple of kills there. Check vertexes in here in the other building. feel like Mario with the way that jumped then. I 
Hello Dad, when are you coming home? I need the milk for my Cocoa Pops. Listen, you just became too needy. That was the worst position. That sight as well. Like I was moving my mouse like this to do it that slow. The 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 sensitivity of that sight was atrocious. It was like way too low. Oh well, GG. Fucking timing. Rank the site, F. Robber, thanks so much for the 22 months, dude. Brett, Pess, can you explain the, the, uh, what the number at the bottom left is when you press page up or down? When you're zoomed in, that's your zero. You can run this RD. You just need the mags. Is it unrealistic for us to put the Valde on this? Been away, but I am back, baby. Or some other site? Maybe that? I just wouldn't mind being able to kill the guys from the Lindleys. Four, five, six. Cool. Uh, Sprig OP, thanks for 25 months, dude. Uh, ads on loading, so you don't miss any of the raid. Thank you for all the laughs. I had watching your videos less than three. GG friends, G JMK. Thanks for six months. Thank you for all the laughs I had watching your videos. No worries, man. No worries at all. Damn, we've already been streaming six hours today. Today's been going fast.
Chat, pineapple and pizza, yes or no? I think you can put whatever you want on pizza. Uh, comp comp composite, thanks so much for the nine months, dude. Best chicken wing flavor. I don't know. Oh, I'm more of a desserts man. Sorry, I'm just multitasking like a mofo. Lurus E plans to get his hand back with an operation in the future, something you would consider a waste of money. I think, um... Pestily moist, pestily moist, pestily moist, pestily moist. Uh, definitely no stab at Lurus at all. Or people that want to do that, but I see it as... Like... I, my looks mean very little to me. My health means a lot to me. I want to be clean. I want to be healthy. But if I have no hair and a weird looking nose, it doesn't bother me. You know what I mean? I don't. I, I have confidence. I, I I can stand in front of a thousand people and talk. I can talk to females. I don't really have any. I don't know. To me, that kind of stuff is just like I don't want to say superficial, but it's just like it means very little to me. Like if you were, if you were to write a list of like what what matters most to me and and least, my looks would mean very little. It would just be like health would be at the very top. Player. Favorite desserts? Ooh. Nuffy pie. You up there? I like making my own ice cream. I'm gonna sit here for a minute. GS doesn't clap me. This might be a bit silly.
ice, ice and salt with he heavy cream. That's sugar. You put in ice cream. It's mostly pretty much a shitload of sugar and cream and... So, do we go chalets or hillside? I feel like chalets will be already looted. And we could probably try and get a kill for easy job. I kind of want to get easy job done. Might even run down this way. EFT world champion and not finding vertexes. I tell you something that BFG does better than any other company I've ever known of. When there's an item that you need, you will not find it. You will spend hours, days, weeks, months trying to find it. But the second you find one, you will find hundreds, if not thousands, if not millions. BSG makes the blue ball you harder than any other game known in existence. How many coftums have I found? Right, you'd, you'd argue it's probably the very similar same uh, spawn rate, if not the same. You know what though? I honestly think the quietest time of the day for gamers is 10 a.m. Pick a server that's 10 a.m. It'll be quieter than quieter than any other time of the day. Because how nuts were the servers popping when I started today? Ever found the fanny pack? Not in years, bro. We're still running the players, but. Alright, let's go try and kill two more. Maybe three. And run out. I could I do a play in last raid in that, but Normies at work and DJs in bed, yeah. Because like most people that play video games all night, you know, would probably go to bed by daylight. So like sometime between 7 and 8 a.m. And then that's around the time, you know, normal people go to work, so. There's a low period about. I'd say from between 7 a.m. till about midday, where 
servers are just that little bit quieter. Looks like he's up. Oh, he's dead. Thanks for being such a nice EFT teacher for me. Nice Greetings too. from Germany. Do you ever planning to come to Germany? Ah, uh, yes. I do plan to come to Germany one day. Seven to go. Alright, cheeky reset. Thanks for the six months. Have you found a blue labs Intel folder yet? I found I found one on a dead scav and it turned my wipe around. Uh, I haven't found one this wipe. Last wipe I did. They're worth like 12 million this wipe. Twenty three million. Jeez. Don't you have to like hand it in to uh to old mate? The light keeper? Two for light keeper. It's nuts. Reset. We've got a couple kills for long row. We've got one kill for easy job. And we'll get the survive for reconnaissance. I would say that that's kind of being blown out due to the, cost, uh, the value of Bitcoin. Because people that are in the end game, right? Um, would all have Bitcoin farms level 3. Which means they're all making a couple of mil a day at the moment from just Bitcoins. So they're willing to pay whatever they need to. And then the rarity of it. Like last wipe, your green and your red key cards and all that didn't really go above, say, 30 or 40 million. But this wipe, they're at like 60 and 70 million. And that would all be due to the fact of Bitcoins. Hey boy, maxed out the Bitcoin farm in the first month. I've been making 1.8 million a day for the uh, past few weeks. Dude, I log into my main account every day and just cash in two Bitcoins. And I've been doing that since the first week because I got Bitcoin farm level three in the first week. I bought all my graphics cards for under 200k each. I do it every watt, and I tell people about it, but... Eh. It is what it is, you know? You told everyone to get graphics cards early, and it ruined it for me. <laughs> you could buy... Honestly, as soon as you get level 15 at the very start of a wipe, you can start buying graphics cards. There's nothing stopping you. At least buy the first 25. Think about it. Like, it doesn't take... It doesn't take... 25 graphics cards, 5 mil, right? That would get, that would cost, that's the value of five graphics cards right now. Didn't have the money. You'd be surprised how easily you could farm 5 million. If that was your only purpose. Like, all I want to do right now is farm 5 mil. Scav run, just run straight out. 
do no backpack runs. Sorry, backpack pistol runs. Cash in hard. Cool, we go again. And reconnaissance is done. 45 tasks to go. We've only done four tasks today. The Clown Prince of Games, thanks for the four months. Hey everyone, do I lose Psycho Sniper progress when I die even if I killed five PMCs and completed the subtask? Yes, you need to survive the raid. What are you using the track task? I just made a spreadsheet myself. And then one of the mods made it better. If you go to exclamation mark task left. And then you go to the second page. That's the one I made. Can't tell the difference between them. I didn't mean the raid. I mean, for example, if I die the next raid, well, you should hand it in. <laughs> you go back into another one, you lose it. And you, if you die. I guess I'll just run over for Marin real quick. Hopefully a scav will spawn, kill the scav. Is that a scav there? Oh. Be worried about players being on the side. Let's spawn down the blow. Down there. be activated. What do you reckon? Do I do the same again? Go up here, check the little house thing. Uh -oh. oh my god. Get over the fucking rock. Trained military soldier can't walk over a basic rock. To be honest, the amount of time I've seen people trip over when I was in the army. You guys said there's a vertex spawn on these chairs. I've come in here at least five or six times and seen no spawns. I don't, I don't want to call BS, but come on, guys. First chair on the left when you went for that one. I've been checking it every round. Right. Hillside. No, I don't use any NVIDIA control panel.
I kind of like that path we took last raid where we just went like hillside and then went over and killed. Oh god. That's fine. Doors open. Either a scav here or. Well, I don't know. Did we get the fifth Tarkola? There's also two spawns in the two-story brown building next to gas station. Next to gas station. You mean that one down there? I haven't seen them spawn there in forever. One on the you mean this building here? You mean the convenience store? Not a gas station, is it? So the spawns that used to be here, right? This corner used to be here. I haven't seen them spawn there in forever and I've checked it so many times. There were spawns on the ground in this room, like here and on this side. I need hot rod still. And then upstairs are the rest. Yeah, we'll take the PP. There were gold chain spawns on this shelf and this shelf. And then on the ground, here. And also here. But like I said, I haven't seen anything like a vertex spawn or a coffin spawn in these locations in forever. Let's see ones. Not bad. Got your vertex. Was it in those spots, Dirk Diggler? So I just check, or did I miss one? Oh, I shouldn't be on this side. You got your vertexes in the drop down building? There's no vertexes spawned in there. I'm done with reserve though. I need other stuff done on this map, so that's why we're going this map. And I said to you guys when I was like I said my biggest concern about going to Kappa was the fact that there's just gonna have to be like some some excessive grinding of certain maps. what we're doing right now. We just have to do a lot of lighthouses and get this done. Because I've got to get easy job, I've got to get long road and the vertexes. So we're doing multiple tasks at the same time. Yeah, the top the top shell is the best part place to get them, but 
I didn't get a good spawn for that, so that's why we're here. Never hit the guy at the back. The good part about the loud gun is it's going to bait in scavs. Because that scav just then counter towards it. Someone's coming up behind us now. Need five more. Risky this, but we'll give it a go. Did him a few times. I think I got him. So what we can do, and this is obviously greedy AF. If you want to get easy job done really fast, you just camp this, this tower and the amount of player scabs that come here are insane. Why is there two here? Yuckies. Always yuckies. Killed a scav? Is that the start of the raid? Remember how I said, like, there's already a guy getting shot at? Must have been it. Four to go. Two to go. This is how we die. I'm okay with two.
I'm not going up in that guard tower. I'll get killed by the uh, AGS or the 50 cal at the back. You guys are crazy. How can I watch angle while scoping? Hold your mouse wheel down. Are we having a good day, first I am, thank you. I can't believe I fucked up that. I don't actually have much ammo left, that's why. Blame the ammo pest. Beautiful. Hello, love. Might be able to get a little bit of a snap on him. Go loot him, no balls. Guess that's what they're going to let me do. Show me some movement. Can I get up that rock side on that over there? That would be the way to do it. I think there's mines there. I think it's more the 50 cal to shoot me from the back. <sighs> I think I stuffed it up. I don't think I'm going to get any more. There's no way crossing without being destroyed trying to cross. I don't have large amounts of ammo either.
Hmm. Look at no balls. Look at him, you fucking no balls. Oh my god, another SVD. day. How close to this is to the gunsmith SVD? Because I might take some of the parts off this. This looks pretty modded. And a three man like that, best to shoot the front or the back guy first. Uh, you shoot, you shoot it so the most amount of them are exposed. So for example, that guy was, the front guy was gonna get the cover first, so we're better off shooting the front one. A nave would have been really terrifying for him because they wouldn't know where, where it's all coming from. It's an ambush. Start a blast. Two, two more kills for easy job. Was it like five or six more for long road? And then we just need to find these bloody vertexes. Archer 1414, thanks for the two years. Um, I suppose we could go this way. I definitely need to check out the SVD to see if 
one of these or I wouldn't mind making the actual gunsmith SVD and then putting it um putting it in the weapon rack. We definitely should have right. five, 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 one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um, Right. I'm <sighs> actually really enjoying Lighthouse today. It's been really good for us. It's something you don't always say. All right, six more long road, two more for easy job, and then vertexes. Well, once we get long road and easy job done, we can technically go reserve for our for our vertexes. Oh. Yeah, weapon rack has two sides. Later on, we'll make we'll make the um. We will make it so the. All the gunsmith guns. We we should just write a list of all the gunsmith guns and. Get that sorted. Yoink. If we need the DVL, with I've got the ASVL well pretty much finished there. We do have an RFB there, actually. I didn't notice that. The vector's an issue for me at the moment. Because there's a part I need that I can't find. But we'll put the SVD in here as well. Alright. I need to go in the bathroom again. Huge raid. Let's do it.
on me. Um, I might better go check the kill here. Fifteen, fourteen, thirteen, twelve, eleven, ten, nine, eight, seven, 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 six, five, four, three, two, one. these last two kills and then we never have to do easy job again well on hardcore at least and we're back on the long road and vertex farming i actually feel like we might find a little more svd players because of Punisher and people being a little bit like later in the wipe, there might be a little bit more people playing trying to get their Punisher quest done. Whereas like early wipe, no one uses SVDs. Can we please walk in there? Dan! The indicator, Lord of Ballistics. Make our bullets shoot true. So I can be done with this map. And the guy's already dead. You serious, Nikita? I just had a shot over there. Need one more. We'll come back for you. I think that player's over there. Is it any target? Any target. Hello. I don't think we worry about this guy. I think we just leave. We have vertexes to farm. Long road kills to get. The good thing about... Um, if those two are dead over there... Is we can... Now not get blown up when we try and get scab kills up here. This hill is extremely deceptive when you're trying to look at it as well, which is really annoying. Is it better to just go for 75 fob? I've used 75 fob since I started playing Tarko. There's people that recommend you put it somewhere in the middle. There's people that say you should have it on the lowest. 
I just think you'll just get used to whatever one you pick. So pick what you think feels most natural to you and then play with that. It's like asking someone what the sensitivity should be, you know? SVD, isn't it? And we're going to start collecting them, hopefully. That's right. Is that your stamina? Rude. I swear I just heard something to the right then. Um... Bait, hey. How many coftums have I found? It's insane. Actually insane. Should we start checking duffel bags? Did we get any vertexes yet? No. No, we haven't yet. I, I believe one day. We may. We may just find one. Do we keep going or do we just reset? Try and do some long road, I guess. I heard an SVD shooting. Found vertexes in duffels and jackets. It's what. Had good luck in building three. The little window hop through room. I haven't been on labs today. Car by sunken village boss halfway in the water in the back. Assuming these guys are dead behind me and I'm not going to get blown up.
I think that was a plow. Yeah, that was a plow. Another USEC. He looked like he had a, uh, a VPR. Which is a sniper. Or is that an SKS? Oh no, that's a different guy, the one I killed. Very risky move trying to take this on. So I haven't found anything on that seat yet. Starting to believe you lied to me, chat. That's the last hot rod we need. I think I'm gonna no balls and try and get this guy sniper off. These guys are fighting but further down. Those scabs can protect me. 16 months of the best content. Thanks, dude. Found Sherman? No, not yet. We're getting stuff done on this map, though. One kill left for easy job. Five kills left for long road. Thousand percent getting away. Who's gonna beam me? I 
I've got a feeling he pushed close, like just here. Definitely didn't kill him. No. The man, the myth, the legend. Oh seven, 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 oh seven. I don't like sitting here. Dirty thirty. Damn! I think the eight months. T Tross thinks the thirty. Jump, make the jump, make the jump, make the jump. Didn't make the jump. All he needs to do is be hiding behind here and I'm dead. Hey, Ben Demo. We've got another sniper, so it's actually big. One with a suppressor too. Oh, man. So close to the long road and um, easy job finished. Agent of pain, thanks for the prime. Is this the current hacker on YouTube? Yep, I'm behind, so sorry if that's a dumb question. No, it's fine. Claustrophobic, thanks to the prime. How goes the fight? It's gone well. Why the change for going to Kappa instead of Max Traders? I thought it'd be fun. Thought I'd give it a go. Off the work pass. Best of luck with the farming. Thanks, dude. Right. PSU for the old Bitcoin farm. Oh, look at the coffins. Another one here. Laid out the past two days after tweaking my back. Ouch. Thanks for the longer streams. They've nice been James. a lot of fun keeping me occupied. Speedy recovery, bro. I'll put that there. Put them down there. Can that go in there? Cool. Well, then. No one then. And then. No one then. Do it like this. And then together.
or hmm, we'll take that out. Could fit there. No more food needed. Unless we're trying to get food for... Um, unless we're trying to get food for... Making... Sugar. All right, one more lighthouse. That will be the end of easy job. And hopefully we can get... All we need is one of those big groups of scavs to spawn on Long Road and we're done. We're just being a little bit shafted. But if I can get Long Road and easy job done, I'm happy to just leave lighthouse for a bit. Uh, and we could potentially find vertexes on... on other maps. Ugh. Otherwise, what we could do... You know, let's just do it. Let's risk it for the biscuit, you know? Where's that mag that I just put away? We need to start working on, on these quests anyway, so... I Hi to... guys, oh, welcome to my so... stream. And without further ado, Tom Scoo, let's the crack straight stream, into it. Alright, let's see if we can get this. This will get the test drive part, sorry, the, the easy job done nice and quick. If we get the good spawn for it. Deep down, you know you're not finding vertexes on other maps. The only other map you really find them on is reserve. So. Hey, Perth, been a while. How's Hardcore to Kappa run going? It's going good, lol. How you doing, man? Would you rather be called lol or ash? Or lol ash. <sighs> man. I want to get at least a quest on on this raid. One task, whether it be easy job or it be long road, I don't care. Just give me one of them done. Or a couple of shooter born kills would be nice. We just got to find the right spot and be patient. <sighs> definitely not the right spot. We're definitely not getting. This is actually not bad for uh, Long Road, at least. Long Road and Shooterborn. Come on. 
I'm sure there's a player running around. Cold spawn rate on customs? I think it's 10%. You have to check the wiki. This is a little bit exposed, but if there's a dude up here, I might be able to snipe him. It did sound like someone was up in that hill area. I hate sitting prone though. Any scabs on the road? Come on. I really don't want to have to push chalets with a bolty. I heard a noise to my right. on. I don't really like this side. Crosshair or something just makes it like take up way too much space.
smile. Laughing boy, thanks for 51 months. Not excited to go up here. Cooked Basil, thanks for the two months. Bad Wolf, thanks for the two months. Bad Wolf 13. Look at Donut. Chicken Uber eats donuts to my house. Like a glazed donut. Definitely heard shots in. Right? It's like a suppressed little burst. I've just got to warm up, you know. <coughs> Should we do the old hello? Hello? Is there something back? Now, now I don't know if I should shoot. Or Some of this brain. Throwing grenades at me now. Need a little bit more elevation and we'll be right. There we go. Bailey's have failed. Seems friendly. Throw a grenade. Yeah. There. 
Is that a scav? Imagine. There's no shot that got him. But imagine if it did. Testily salute. Decayed, thanks for twenty five months. Game hates me. I'm convinced. <sighs> God, I wish they'd fixed the looking into buildings from range being completely black then. Depends on the sun. One task on this road. I need five more long road kills, or I need one more easy job. What's it gonna be? Okay, that's a bit weird. That's him there, I just can't see his head properly. Mm. I missed a shot, he's gonna kill me though, that's the problem. Go for this one. 
What do you reckon there? Didn't see any sp sparks. I feel like it shouldn't be that far. Oh, yeah, that was a little bit low. Let's go there. Okay, it's not four. Let's try five. Okay, let's try six. I'll be click. Uh, this has to be a click, right? Okay, that's high. Let's go that dot there. We got up. Where's the other 50 cal? Come on here. Must be behind that. All right, let's try and get this one real quick. All right, so there. Yeah. Oh, he's looking at me. He's looking at me. One of zero the scope doesn't work, bro. Die. Got him. Cool. Easy job's done. Gotta find long road scabs. If I want to get gear, I could just go clean up this. Oh, there's gotta be scabs along the road somewhere. I don't know how many times I had to message Nikita to even get him to spawn on the bloody road. We'll check hillside. At that range, would the accuracy start falling off on a T5000? No, this is a 7.62 gun. Right, it's a 308. I could, with my own 308 bolty, hit very accurately out to, I'd say, 800 meters. That shot right there was about 350, 400. Yet, yeah. struggle time, you know. The one thing Tarkov does really well is the trajectory of bullets is really cool how they do it, but they don't make it realistic at all. They make it very gamey because it's like, like a 5.56 round over 300 meters is like, I'd probably say about 200 millimeters or like eight inches of deviation. So like pretty much the size of someone's head is about how much deviation there would be on a 556 five, round over 300 meters. Right. Yet in Tarkov, you shoot someone at 300 meters with a 556 five, round, you're aiming like four meters above their fucking head. Uh, Nova, I've got no idea, dude. Joseph, no worries, dude.
I think I'm going to take a break from Lighthouse. We've done a lot of raids in a row. Ooh, ammo. I'm tempted to start looting duffel bags on this map to see if we can get a vertex in it. It's connect! this house onto our rotation. Come on, give us a vertex. Just one. Just one cheeky little vertex. Not asking for a lot. Got a Bitcoin. We got one task done. Easy job. Look how hard is it to get scabs to spawn in the long row? Seriously. Yeah, that was 380 meters to shoot that rogue. Hi, Pistol. Would you consider using one of those eye tracker apps? No, because then you see me look at my radar. <clears throat> if only you had some red flares pop on the road, wait for the looty boys. Nah. But I'd want to loot it as well. Here's some luck for your day. At least hope they line up nicely rewarded. Let's see how we go. AK-104. We might actually... Do we need an AK-104 still?
on the vector is 11. So MPX, RSAS, HK, ASVAL, DVL, AK102, AKMN, SVD, and then an M1A. And the M700 and the 1911. M4, Mutant. Oh no, but you don't need to go that far for... I think the M4 is the last one. Guns with 22, isn't it? AK-102. I actually need an AK-102. Eliminate any PMC operators from a distance less than 30 meters on reserve. Five screwdrivers. Free reserve right day. Eh? We're not going to get that done. Eliminate scabs using an SVD. Survive three woods. Could be useful. I don't know if we actually need that. The AR-15 tactical. Pestily is it. bestily. We need an AK-102, but I don't think we're going to get that quest on. Put the Zook there. We can hand it straight in. Lovey Griffle, thanks for the dive buds. Oh, all right. All right. Easy job's done. We could go for Sturmy. Try and get some more sniper rifles. Pack of shooter part four. <clears throat> Mental gets three levels, yeah. So I have to get level three snogs before we hand it in to skip to get the guide. Let's go do a woods raid. Oh, SVDs. Happy 18 so months. Daily? No. Less than Paradox three. thinks that eight months. Death Brood thinks that 18 months.
Congrats, bravo. Congrats. Any tips for uninstalling Dark Oak? Go to the launcher. I think that's where you do it. Oh. X wipe. I'm rushing to unlock Killer Quest and then rushing to do it because I ha got hard stuck on it for over a few, over a week due to farmers and cheaters sp spamming him. Not a smart tactic because at the start of the wipe, he was a 5% spawn chance. So you'd have to do 20 raids to find him. And I can guarantee you over those 20 raids when he finally does spawn, there's someone in there trying to find him too. I just didn't even care about bosses this white at all. Just said stuff it. And I, I haven't even got Kappa on my main account yet. If they, if they have the boss spawn rate under 20% next wipe, I am not going to be trying to push towards getting Kappa until it's Back up to 30. They don't realize, and I tried to explain it to Nikita, but he doesn't realize it turns into a big bottleneck. So what happens what is, no one kills the bosses because they don't spawn. So everyone ends up getting on the boss quest. And then when they finally do crank up the spawn rate, so say the spawn rate goes from 5% or 8%, which they started on the first two, three weeks, and they finally put it up to 30%. But now you've got like four four or five people per raid trying to get the scav boss. Well, there's five people trying to get the scav boss. That means only one of the five can get him. So you, if it's a 30% spawn rate, it's more like a one in five chance. So it's like 6% of the time you'll get the boss before someone else. Like say, say the first person to get to the boss that's farming the boss gets to him, right? And there's five of you going for it. You've got a one in six chance. So it ends up becoming back to 6% spawn rate, which means you then have to do another 20 raids to see the boss and get him. It's just fucking annoying. Remember the lag time on this? I think 45 or 44, isn't it? Stamina could be up. Is um is. Oh, my brain's got to start fucking working one day. Is the rogues on woods at the moment? Goons. Are the goons on woods at the moment? Yes. All right, so it could be goons. I just heard someone shooting to the right. Up. Oh. Our boy's up. He's on the low ground. Oh. That's rough. Do I rather go for Sturman or do I rather go for that player over there? I think that I ran that way. That could be an M1A with a thermal. Or test drive.
I'm taking a gamble here, hoping he's pushed to the other side. No, oh, no shot. Fuck me. Chances. That's the time he decides to fucking sprint around. Oh, fucking sucks. He just ran up and sat by the tree. What's an SKS? Uh, what now? That guy's a... How could that guy be... It doesn't make sense that that guy's cheating. But the guy's level 38 and he's been to Lightkeeper. If that guy's cheating, he's the worst cheater ever because he ran straight past me. He's got 400 hours and he's been to Lightkeeper. Might have done the cheese. Well, the kill Zarachi thing. Before Strim and Mr. Pest, you must stand trial for your countrymen. Explain and defend the horror of Vegemite to us. Why Vegemite should we not delicious. cast you all out for this great evil, I ask? I love Vegemite. He had an SKS, by the way. You keep the achievement after profile wipe. He could have started the game. He's only got 400 hours on the account. Like, technically, he could have reset his account. There was, there was nothing sus with what he did, though. Hmm. Just that every time I see someone with, like, before level 40, and they've got... Lightkeeper achievement, they've nearly always been sus. This is the first one that hasn't been. All right, I'm going to finish up there. That's a solid eight hour sesh. Um, thanks so much for the uh, follow bit subs. You guys are amazing as always. We'll be continuing on this tomorrow. I'm just a little bit tired. And, I, and it, it's very draining trying to stay so focused, but we actually had a really good day. Really good day. We've got easy job part two done. Make sure we're up to date. So Punisher, we've got Punisher 5 done today. Uh, we've got easy job part two done. We also got that one, which reconnaissance done. So we've only got three tasks left. Intimidators at level 45. And that's just get scav headshots. So that one's nice and easy. Test drive and Punisher 6 and then prep is done. Therapist's Being crisis at level 48. Love we're not going to be doing colleagues part three. So I reckon we just tick that because we're not going to actually do that one. We're going to do, um, we're going to do saddest instead. Uh, we've got five or four kills left for long road. We still need to get the Emicon key to get vitamins done. Missing cargo is after we finish a long road. And that's just as simple as go to a certain spot on lighthouse and do it. So that's nice and easy. Wet job part six is just getting sniper levels. The guide is after wet job part six. Samples, we're going to have to get those keys, those stems, and it's going to be a bit rough. Terror group employee, we need to get the card off Sanitar. So we have to go kill Sanitar for that. Lendlease part two is the Vertexes, which we can't find. Once we get Lendlease part two, we get peacekeeping mission. I'm already starting to collect the armors, so that's not going to be too much of a problem. Somnia is nighttime kills. Gunsmith are going to be a serious problem. Psycho sniper and shooter born will do um, in the process of doing Tarkov shooters. Controllers, the flashbang task. Trophies, Rashala. Sadist is Sanitar. Sellouts, Killer. Woodkeeper is Sturman. Hunting trip, Sturman with the Bolty. Razor part two is just kill some raiders. We got Razor part one done today. Pestily salute. Um, and straight dogs is after we get Killer and Sturman done. So I think we're sitting in a really good spot. We've got four SVDs now. Three or four SVDs. We've got... um. We're starting to collect up a lot of stuff for sniper rifles. Really unfortunate I didn't get that guy then. 
Um, because I feel like Santa that was just out there in the open, blasting away. But yeah, much love. Thanks for all the follows, bit subs. Um, I'll be back tomorrow. How much long to what? To what? Like three months, at least four months. I'll be back tomorrow, and we'll uh, continue. Watch it on YouTube. Hope you guys enjoyed it. A hearty month for me. Bye bye.